second here. Hi. Hello. Right. Right. So do we podcast any of this? Mm -hmm. Like take the recorded shows and put them up on like the podcast on YouTube. YouTube. I right, ten seconds. It's on. It's on. Thirty people. Forty. Hey guys, what's going on? Welcome to Buddha Radio on Hamilton Radio. We're on Facebook Live, <laughs> DementedRadio.com. Somebody's got their turn their volume down in the room here. They don't know me. who it is. Me. It's not me. No, I got it. Uh, what's up, everybody? It's Thursday. Welcome to Buddha Radio. I am Buddha the comedian to my right. Hello, John Conti. In what's the up, house. everybody? And everything's better. Spiked. What's up, Spikey? Hey, man. What's up? We wanted to let you guys know. There's all you know. There's no excuses, man. We are all over the place. Like if you're if you're in front of a computer right now, you're you have the advantage because you can listen. You can go in a chat room. You can write to us. We're a totally like interactive show, man. So we will respond to you. If you want to call and uh, yell at us knuckleheads, the phone number to call on is uh, 609-800-1003. And uh, we also if you look have on the screen. It's up there. Yeah. Well, if you if you're now. listening on is it uh, down below now? <laughs> if you're listening on Hamilton, you're not going to be able to uh, to read the screen. But um, we are on Facebook. There's also an easier way to listen to. Fucking Jim, would you make up your mind? If you hop Sorry. in, your, if you hop in your car, you can dial six four one seven nine three nine four six nine. If you get in your car or you're around, you want to listen on your phone. It's six four one seven nine three nine four six nine. That just shoots you right into their computer. Nobody answers the phone. The show is just aired live, so you can just listen to it while you're driving around and put it on your Bluetooth. It's a good that's, time. That's crazy. Yeah. I want to say. You could make a phone call and listen to us? Yeah, it'll be on. You just listen on your phone. Wow. Yeah. yeah. That's, al that's almost cool, like. Yeah. That's almost, yeah, it's cool, but it's almost like a nightmare. I mean, you dial the phone and we're what you get? That's right. <laughs> Holy shit, that's, that's messed right. up. You're lucky. Scary. That's yeah. messed up. You're lucky. <laughs> Um, and it's not like a 900 number or nothing? No, the phones aren't. No. In, it is in India, so if you, but you, can, but you, you have... But you can still touch uh, yourself, right? Long, it's long just distance. you don't have to pay for it. This guy's always touching if himself. If you have a long-distance plan, it only costs $87 a minute. But, um, Outstanding. No, but it's cool. But uh, now, um, I think my mom's listening, hopefully. She just, Hi, uh, Mom. Happy birthday, Mom. Happy birthday. Happy birthday, Belated. Happy, happy birthday, birthday Mom. Mom. It was her birthday yesterday. Hope you enjoyed that cake. I it baked her was, cake. It was a lovely-looking cake. It was. She lived. She lived through it. She lived through it? Yes. Outstanding. Well, that's a good thing. You, you uh, baked it? I baked it. He baked it. I made her. her yeah. and, and decorated right. it. Yeah. My, like 3% of my DNA is chocolate. I better be able to make a fucking cake. <laughs> I made uh, her a uh, of three course layer. He, of course he baked the cake. That's, that's, how, that's how he got all that stuff fixed. I, I, I thought he was going to tell that's me his a, pappy was a cook in a county jail. <laughs> three layer chocolate cake, cannoli filling. Yeah, I didn't mess around. Three layers. My mom cut into it. She goes, it's three layers. <laughs> she was all excited. <laughs> Ooh. <laughs> Way to go, Bob. Yeah. But, um, so it's Thursday. Thank you for joining us. And uh, again, we're on Demented Radio, too. I think he hears us on Friday, right, Gene? I think so, yeah. Yeah, in California, so that's a cool. DementedRadio.com. Demented Radio, is that any relation to uh, Dr. Demento? Probably not, because there's no. an O on the end of his name. Yeah, but it could be, you know, these are changing times. And if you're having trouble after all of that, <laughs> and you just can't figure it out, you could go to... Boot of the comedian .com where I have every friggin' link possible. So 
it's easy to listen. And uh, I don't know if you guys have you guys seen the new I made the new logos. Yes, I yeah, did. Yeah, the logo looks yes, cool. Yes, I, I did. Like you, did you see the picture? Yeah. Where I'm grabbing the two of you in my hand. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> You're gonna fuck a bookie. Um, I I'm always the bookie. I am the motherfucking cavalry. But uh, fucking King Kong. You haven't, it, yeah. If you haven't seen that trailer yet. We got a lot going on. We got a lot to discuss. That's why we got Sam Jackson in the movie, just so he can say motherfucker. We're digging our uh, 6.30 time slot, right? You guys liking it? Yeah, All it's right. pretty cool. It's cool. We start it's being cool. funny. We'll be funny in about... See, we, we're used to being funny at 7, so give us 25 minutes. <laughs> yeah. <to> start. <laughs> we'll get better. It's like an airplane. You got to wait till we get to 30,000 feet. <laughs> And, uh, yeah, it's like an airplane that's going down. You can't look away. You want to look away. You don't want to watch, but you got to. But Spike, you got to understand, in order to go down, you got to go up first, right? So yeah. So we're on our way up right now. Oh, really? So put your tables to their upright positions. Holy Christ. Eat your penis. and uh, Eat your penis. <laughs> and away so we go. How was your, 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 your night, boss? Your steward will be going around passing out your how penises. Was, how was, I'm, 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 I was hearing you went to White Castle. Really? Oh, dude. <laughs> what happened? <laughs> no, no, a long story before that. What happened, man? What happened? Uh, I went and did the Johnny P show last night. Oh, uh, yeah, Johnny P. Uh, late night with Johnny P. He's a character, isn't he? Oh, he's wild. Man. Oh, my God. He's, he he is a trip, dude. He reminds me of Joe Pesci. Oh, he of really course does. he is. He's Joe Pesci. Oh, he's like totally. fucking second. He'll tell me. I'm, he's a great I'm, guy. I'm seven feet taller than him and still punch me in the mouth if he had to. You know what I mean? <laughs> that kind of guy. And he, and he gives you that, like, you're waiting for him to look and go, you know, wait a minute, I'm going to go get my fucking shine box. Yes. <laughs> you know what I'm yeah. saying? Well, where are the shovels? Yes. Oh, he's so funny. Yes. He's a fucking guy. first hole I ever dug. This ain't the it, it was an experience, done. man. It, 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 was, it was pretty fucked up for me. I, I had a, I just remember team like twice. Yeah, why? What happened? Well, we, it's different. It's it's you know we're used to being on stage and feeding off the audience and getting the audience reaction and stuff yeah, like you're that. Laughter. Now well, you're, at least I am. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I don't get laughter. You know that. I should be used to this shit, right? You know, the pros are used to it. Yeah. See, I pick on John constantly. And, you know, you, he does not have the thick skin. He is the typical, I will cut you, you know, if you keep <laughs> continuing. And he's like that on stage. So, by all means, if you're ever at a show, fuck don't with him. Fucking fuck stage. with him because he gets so bent out of shape on stage that he will just... He doesn't know. He just attacks you. He'll he just, just, he'll just stop you. the show in the middle of the show and just... You're his focus now. You are his world. And you really yeah, don't want to. You. you really don't want to feel like, like that. No, nobody's going to come to any of my fucking shows. No. They okay, will. they'll they go up to the show and they'll be they like, I heard a friend and go, go ahead. We were at a show once, once and John's like, shut the fuck up over there. What's going on? Uh, Poor lady's giving birth. He's yelling at a fucking woman <laughs> giving birth in the corner. Well, tell that kid to shut up already. He's two minutes old. Teach him a lesson. Yeah, no. So you're on the sound stage. Right. Okay, and in front of you is three cameras, mm -hmm. and then you have the, the studio audience, but you can't really see that because all you're seeing is the cameras and the lights. Similar to our setup here. No, 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 no. <laughs> this is a this is this was a professional, bro. I felt like I was getting, going on Johnny Carson. No, really, I'm serious. This is a real professional, nice uh, a production assistant, met us. Okay. They got titles. Wow. And he's got, listen, she's like, anything you need, we'll get for you. I mean, we felt like fucking A-list guests, I swear to God. <laughs> wow. Uh, they had a catered and shit. It was, it was nice. It was real nice. But again, performing, you're used to feeding off the audience and stuff. You couldn't hear them. They could hear you, but you couldn't, you couldn't even, hear them. Not even a monitor. I couldn't Were you like even, in a sound stage? Myself. Was there glass It was a sound stage. No, but it wasn't glass. It's the way they have it arranged with the curtains. And camera stuff. guys are in between you the, and the, the camera guys right. are in between, and you don't get it. You don't hear shit. They're actually laughing. I don't hear it. I had to start over twice. Oh. I was like, because I wasn't hearing it, mm -hmm. so I had to put it in my head that I'm gonna hear it. Right. You know, and then I was able to do, you know, do a bit, a couple bits. But I actually liked it. I heard. It threw me off too. I. I it, it was you know, fucked up. It's yeah. different than being on a live stage. I should have warned you. Oh, I wish you would have, because I would have been yeah. ready for that. I was not ready. I had to record my first one, and then, like, the, the, the second time I went up, again, I don't hear any laughter, and I'm like, oh, you heard that one before? You know, and then they started laughing, because it's the second time I'm doing the right. same joke. But it was like, uh, how do I explain it? I just, right in the middle of my first two minutes, I just stopped. Because yeah. I remembered him doing three or four takes on his entrance. Right. So I know it's being taped, so I was like, can we start that over again? <laughs> wow. Now guy's like, huh? <laughs> you know, it's like, can hey, we start this over again? 
So uh, it, it ended up being good. It was nice. We didn't get out of there until like 11.30 at night. Mm-hmm. We were there at 6. Wow. Yeah, it was a long taping. They had some little kid that played Elvis and stuff. It was cool seeing an 8-year-old into Elvis because I would like that generation to know who Elvis was. Yeah. I mean, I would like he that. wasn't my favorite, but Elvis was rock and roll, man. He was. And they're actually closing the Elvis... Uh, Museum in, in Vegas. Really? Because this generation has no clue who the fuck Elvis was. Nobody's going. That just seems wrong. It, it definitely. On so many levels. So, but, uh, so we got Dawn. We got Dawn. We got Dory, Greg, Mark, Janice. What's up, guys? Um, I don't know what's going and on. Oh, yeah, we got the feedback fixed, guys. Thank you. They were saying uh, they heard the, uh, the echo going on. Uh, I'm sorry about that. But we fixed all that. We took echo, care of that. Echo, echo. But yeah, um, sure, if you're listening right now, uh, there's a Facebook Live feed. You go in the chat room to communicate with us. Or as always, you can call in. 609-800-1003. That's 609-800-1003. Operators are standing by now. Call. Wow. So we get out of there at 11 o'clock, right? Mm-hmm. And uh, I got Mark with me. They don't know that shit. We're hanging out. And, uh, you know, we... Uh, we had a little bit on the way, you know, to the studio and stuff. Right. And uh, Mark's like, like, what I'm, hey, you want to stop at a diner or something? He's like, yeah, it sounds good to me. So <laughs> <laughs> it's like, all right. So we wanted to get down at least towards Seaside. Right. So I looked at him. I said to him, you know what? Fuck it. We, I took him to the Cove. We were going to go, you know, where, where do we are to do our comedy. I figured, you, you know, pretty good get a bar pie or whatever, you know, yeah. have a couple beers together. Hit the sushi bar. We fucking walk in. They were, they were just closing. What time was uh, this? It was like midnight. Uh, they were just closing. It was a Wednesday night, and I was like, yeah. ah, that sucks. Yeah. So I looked at my coat home. Well, this is all we got left is McDonald's, Wendy's, or White Castle. I can hear that. Kumar over there. Either that or a, or a, or a, or a Wawa. So Wendy's is always the like, way to go. Man. My, wife, salads. my wife's been away all week, man. They got, <laughs> they can't go wrong well with a big potato. Jesus. You know? So... You don't go to that castle, bro. That oh, Mark goes, let's go to White Castle. Oh. oh, dude, let me tell you. It was hard. It was real hard. I I, I couldn't eat it. I was going. You can't eat it. No. No. You're not supposed to. <laughs> no, I'm just it's saying. It's made for human consumption. I, I love I, I, I had love one White and a half. Castle. I had to get a puke. Then I had another half, and I had a puke. <laughs> See, you say you don't do impressions, but that's an impression of a swimsuit model. (laughs) (laughs) You don't want to eat White Castle. You can go to Ethiopia. They'll they'll, they'll, they'll go, no, 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 my friend. You know what went down easy? A fucking yodel. A yodel. I had no problem with a fucking yodel. (laughs) I'll house a fucking yodel right in the face. I don't care. I love yodels. Oh, man. I looked at Mark and I go, dude, I'm telling you. He looked at me and goes, what's the matter? I said, it's not going down right. It's just, I know, I can't eat this shit. Right? He looked at me, I go, but you want to know what I will be able to fucking eat? I go, watch. And I threw him a pack of fucking yodels. And I had a pack, I opened it up, I took a bite. He goes, see, fucking no problem, going down easy. Now ask him, where did he have the yodel? He's got, see, fat guys have like glass that you break, like, you know, in case there's a in fire. case there's an emergency. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, there was no glass. Oh, you didn't, he had an extra one, so he didn't have to break the glass. No, actually, no, it was, it, I, I hope my wife's not it's listening. It's pains of cellophane that he has taped to himself, <laughs> and he just rips it open. Clear! We never have a yodel now. Looks like Yoda. We never have yodels in the house. Never. Of course. Okay. My wife's away all week. (laughs) I went and picked up some uh, lunch meat and cheese, and I'm standing there and I get tasty cake on sale for a dollar fifty. I was like, man, I haven't had yodels in a long time. If I do this, which one's yodel? The round. The, the, the like logs. The logs. Like, little logs. Like, how they come like out. Like the Swiss too. rolls. Yeah. Like the Swiss <laughs> rolls. They come out like that. Yeah, but this is my thinking now. This is the way I'm thinking. I'm standing there. I'm going, you know what? I can do this. Okay? Because if I get it, right? i got to finish it before she gets home. Right. I can't have it. I can't have a fucking trace in the house. No. Because no. she'll be like, when did you get fucking yodels? Because no matter how okay. good a hiding spot you think no. you got. Oh, she'll always fucking fuck Oh, absolutely. Them. They got like a detective, yeah. man. It's like, beep, beep, beep. They walk in the house. They're like... You farted before I walked in. Uh, oh yeah, exactly. And I just cleaned that last week, so I know it wasn't yeah, there last week. Don't tell me no bullshit about how long it's been there. Yeah, you so got to prepare like OJ when you bring yodels home. You got to have isotoners on. You got to have gloves. Dude, you got to you really yeah, leave any traces of anything. But this is this is the fucking mentality now. This is the way it is. It's like you're thinking about it. And you're like, hey, we can do this. We can get this done. It's easy. Man. It's a fucking four pack. 
If it was a six pack, I'd say no. She's coming home Saturday. But it's only a four pack. And you know what? They're so hard to find because they have that little square cardboard that fucks yes. you up. <laughs> yes. And nothing else ever comes in there. <laughs> and there's always that little strand of choice. So she's going to tear garden. it up and shit. That's it. She's going to have yodel. You ain't your house. Yodels were in the house. Son of a bitch. That's it. You, you can't make a yodel piece of cardboard look no, like a yodel. No, I'm not gone <laughs> three days and you've got a case of yodels in here. How many did you buy? Is there any left? That's a, oh, you ate them yeah, all? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Did you get that? Yeah. Is there any left? No. Did you, you oh, you ate them all? Well, so Mark, Mark was here. Yeah, what did he have? One? Like, I mean, not really, but, you know, he was here. That's why you know God was a man. Because if God was a woman, semen would taste like yodels. <laughs> now, now I know, I'm just saying. Now I know what the, like, the Jewish people felt like when the Gestapo pulled up. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? It's like, oh, you like, by the way, like a five-year-old, by like the a way, little fucking kid. I'm like, uh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna. By the way, Ma, see what you've been listening, you've been missing. This is, what, I talk about semen and yodels. So enjoy the show. But no, I, I know. Well, you and another proud uh, mother watches. Hey, hey, wait, hey, hey, enough of this. My wife, my wife's watching now. Oh, is she? Oh, Christ. Christ. oh, oh yeah, yeah, this she is. <laughs> She's gonna be like, "What the fuck were you talking about? Yodeling in the canyon? What?" <laughs> Janice, Janice said, "When you, uh, your granddaughter gets older, you can blame the yodels on her. That's what you have to do." You blame it on the kids. Oh, are you kidding? I already, for, for Christmas, <coughs> I said the kids are going to come visit. I bought cookies. <laughs> you know why I love the first time I, I watched my son went trick-or-treating? Because I could hide candy throughout the house and just say, I don't know, that little fucker probably hit it because I wanted to take it from him. And you just buy the fun size ones. You know what I'm saying? I oh, mean, yeah. Because you eat seven Snickers, it eats a regular bar. So oh, it's all good. But oh, I'll tell you what, during Christmas, my wife made the best uh, ricotta cookies. You ever have those? No. Holy shit! You gotta, I gotta get her to make them for you. All right. Oh man, darling, they're great. Yes. So Mark, nothing like Mark's here was talking about. He thought I had the lap band, and I said no. I got, I didn't get the lap band because my surgery works. That's why I get yours. <laughs> well, they, they took you. Could, they took my stomach away. Out. See, I kind of compare lap band surgery to like when when a heroin addict. Like if a, it's a heroin addict, you don't put long sleeves on them. That's not gonna help. <laughs> no. You need to remove their veins completely, so there's nowhere to shoot the fucking drug. Like you could just shoot drugs all day. It's not gonna happen. It would just eject. That's the same thing with me. I could not have a lap band. I would eat through the. Fu- if I had lap bands, eat through. it wouldn't. In like six months, it wouldn't be a band anymore. There'd be one asshole playing the cymbals. Well, where, <laughs> where do you stand on lap bands? <laughs> What's that? How about a lap dance? Lap dance is fine. Okay. You ever get a lap dance from a girl who had a lap band? <laughs> No. <laughs> that's a lot, a lot. A lot of stretch marks and a lot of extra skin. Yeah, that's... Get that shit taken care of, ladies. Oh, my God. But she can hide a doll like a mother. <laughs> <laughs> and a pack of yodels, I hear. <laughs> and and uh, never gave her one, either. She could walk out with the freaking stripper pole under her flap. <laughs> She's got a fucking fudge and yodels and... <laughs> yeah, my, yes, my, my, my wife's going to hang up on this any second. Right. <laughs> She's, like, she's still listening. Hey, I, I was turning on and heard wow. semen and yodels. I said, I said, what I, the I, hell are they talking about? I always say that. I go, hey, were you listening? John, you're not going to that show anymore. <laughs> I turned it on. I don't get you guys. I just don't get you. After five minutes, I couldn't understand it. You talk over each other. Fuck that. I turn it off. Of course, Craig Loigren said semen and yodels are his two of his favorite things. Which is bullshit, because ladders and platform shoes are two of your favorite things. <laughs> Oh my god. Yeah. yeah, so my wife's down in uh, DC with her daughter and my granddaughter. She's having a blast with my granddaughter without me. I am so pissed off. At DC, what is she doing? Like going to the zoo and well, stuff? Well, my, my, my stepdaughter's a teacher. Watch the monkey cage because <laughs> kids fall in. <laughs> Believe me. My wife's got this kid strapped in. She went and bought a, uh, a, an extra stroller because she couldn't fit the other one in, in, in her car. Oh, really? Oh, yeah. Because, see, my stepdaughter see, is that's a, she's a teacher. Right there. You ever heard of a bungee? You just bungee the cord, the freaking trunk closed. No, Women are like, I'm going to go buy. This This stroller has to match my car. It has to be the same color as my vehicle. I'm, I might need it again sometime. You never know. I'll probably I'll need it, it again. I'll just use it the next time I have her and we go somewhere. That's how women think. Guys, no. We'll take it apart and then put it back together when we get there. That's it. It's unbelievable. But, uh, and Dante she, uh, involved. she visited the zoo today. You know, she took the kid to the zoo and everything. Like I said, my, my stepdaughter is a, uh, a teacher, and, and the kids, uh, it's an AP class uh, high school. They had a trip to Washington, D.C. Right. So she's got to be with the kids, and they couldn't bring the baby on the bus, insurance reasons or whatever. The kid's only four months old, so 
my wife drove her down. And my wife is having a blast with my granddaughter, and I'm not there. That sucks. Uh, but you got yodels. You got yodels. I got yodels. <laughs> I, I compensate. It's, hey, it's, no. it's, it's a trade-off. No, no, hey, hey, hey. You, you, no, you, you, were, you were thinking about yodels. She's on. I you were get nothing. You were thinking about yodels. You were thinking about yodels and White Castle, right. and neither Next one day on a yodel say, okay? There's no easy way to say yodels yay. Shut the fuck up. <laughs> Odo's yay. What's the fake one called? What, ho-hos? Oh, ho- no, ho-hos. No, ho-hos is the original. No, ho no, they were yodels no, first. They're, they're yodels were the fucking first. best. No, I think ho-hos was a three-way with a hooker. Yeah, ho-hos, 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 ho-
this uh, this thing, like, you know, when you pull up to a bank, the draw, the, they draw? Open, the draw opens up. You put your money in, okay? And they take the money. Oh, wait, like from the other side? Yeah, uh, from okay. the other side of the glass, mm -hmm. right? They, that's how they did it. And then when the bucket came, they stuffed it in the fucking drawer. <laughs> what the And hell? they shoved the drawer through. And they opened up the drawer. It's like one like of those bank things, right? So we go back to his place. We're eating all this chicken and everything. And we had this big pile of bones. He used to just open up the window. There were these dogs that lived in the alley. He just drove out there. I go, they're fucking chicken bones. He goes, nah, those dogs, not that they'll fucking kill them. Oh they're Bronx God. dogs. He really? goes, oh, no I shit. I got an ex-wife I got to get rid of. Where do I go? <laughs> Where do we go? I'll shove her in the draw. Well, that's like anywhere. Like, can you go to any bad city? Like Irvington, we're driving on the parkway. My girlfriend has to go to the bathroom, you know? So we pull off because she has, yeah, we're in traffic. So the whole, she goes in and comes out within three seconds. She's like, there's nowhere to go. It's, there's a store, and then there's a bulletproof glass, and there's like this little, like it's a cash check cashing place. I'm like, you should have just stole shit on the way out. Like, how are they going to stop you? They can't, how are they come around to the front? Around. Yeah. So thank God we found an auto body shop, and I ran in. I'm like, listen, man, i got to use your restroom. You know what I'm saying? I just need an estimate. They're like, oh, because I have an 04. There's a million things wrong with it. Just check, you know, just get, give me some false-ass shit. I'm just like, yeah, I got a shit piece. Nice. <laughs> I'm here to wreck your plumbing. <laughs> <laughs> no, in Irvington, no. You could put a dead body in there. Hey, they, Richard Brokaw. They flush babies in Irvington down the freaking shit. Yeah, they're horrible. I wanted to talk about this. Did you guys hear about this thing, the baby box? The baby box? What's yeah, that? you guys haven't heard about this? No. Uh, New Jersey, the first state to distribute the baby box, baby box. to prevent newborn deaths. So what? Yeah, they're apparently the government. What, you put your baby in this box and it like... Yeah. Yep. You hermetically sealed a baby in a box? Um, 2016, last year, 57 babies died in their sleep, according to state data. Nearly all of these young lives could have been saved had they been sleeping properly. So that's what we're doing now. Our Your government money is... Go into these assholes that don't know how to watch over their kid, and they put shit in their kid. Like, okay, why do you are, do you feel happy that this is where your money's going? First of all, having a baby is a luxury. Okay, it's not. If I could, if I could afford another kid, I'd have another kid. I can't afford another kid. I also know that if I have a baby, I could afford a box to put him in. I guess you know what I'm saying. So what? Yeah, but it's. Well, there you go. Your state's got your baby box. growing up. Okay. We never had these problems. We never had problems like this. No. There was never, you never heard about shit like this. No. Not you know, that, that's just like, I mean, like a kid today going out on a bicycle. He's got to have knee pads, well, these are shoulder all the, pads, that's elbow like taking pads, a, a fucking helmet and everything else. These are all the liberals saying, oh God, we need to help everybody. Bullshit, man. How about if you, if you can't afford to buy a box to put your kid in, maybe, I don't know. Give a blowjob instead. How about that? I don't know, ladies. What, you know, I don't know. And you know what's great? What is it? You know what's perfect? This is exactly what I'm thinking right now. You see this box you put a baby in? It's a literal safe space. That's what it is. You're giving out safe spaces. They should write safe space on the side of it. Here's your safe space. Also, it comes with. It does come with diapers, and it does come with baby formula. But should also. Wait, you know how. You know how long that's gonna It should also come with a participation trophy to give the child at a later date in their life. And if you outgrow this box, you can go to Sam's Club and keep upgrading it. <laughs> <laughs> I think that's awesome. How long that's going to last? The first, I think that's the fucking first, awesome. The first, first child that dies in one of those boxes. Oh, they're going to sue the government. Sue the co they're going to sue the government, sue the company, yep. and everything else. That's exactly what I was saying. And, and, and you'll never hear about the box again. <laughs> we, we, should start, we should start an online service right now. And take uh, shoe boxes. We're taking orders right and, now. And just mail them. You, you email us, and we'll we'll we'll, we'll, we'll send you a shoe box. We'll, we'll send you a good one too. We'll send you pro kits. I'm surprised Nike hasn't so jumped Nike. all over this. Oh shit. yeah. Uh, what else? No. Well, well, they, you, crossover. You, you, you say, a new thing. You put an extra ten dollars. Jordan gets you a. An extra ten dollars get you Michael Jordans. Yeah. Just a box. Free baby new, box. New, new Air Jordan. Infants. It's ridiculous. If, you can if if I. No, I can't see my granddaughter sleeping in a box. <laughs> it's just not happening. Uh, you know, it's not going to happen. She's sitting up already. Is she? Yeah, my wife's telling me this, and I'm like, you're pissed off because I, I didn't get to see it. Oh, yeah. Well, that's why she's having fun, because she's not around you. <laughs> yeah, I know. That's how it works. Yeah, well. You, you know, know, you do your thing. You, 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 can, you can suck up all you want. She's not on anymore. I don't care. She <laughs> listens. I love her. She's, you know, I know what it's like to hang out with you. I'm here for two hours. I want to stay up in the <laughs> island. <laughs> I'm kidding. 
Oh, I love you too, you fuck. Uh, you know. uh, babe, we had a baby, it's a boy, it's in the box. Thanks. It's in the box. I can't wait for cats to shit on... Like, Come on down, get your <laughs> baby in a box. Like, really dark children. Like, just, the cats think they're shit in a box. Don't confuse poor cats. It's ridiculous. I hate yeah, cats. as long as you're not playing with it. As long as you're not playing with it first. <laughs> I can't imagine. My mother would kill... Ma, I, mean, I wish she could call in right now. My mother would be like... Your ass wouldn't fit in a box. <laughs> She's like, "Wait, you kidding me? What happens with twins? You get two boxes, or is it a double? You know, is it a double wide? For me and your parents would have had like fucking refrigerator boxes. You know? <laughs> if you're Mexican, they send you home with a banana box. It's got that's Chico's what, on the that's, side. That's what Johnny sleeps in. <laughs> I don't get it, man. I don't get it. Tell me what. Tell me what I'm missing. If, for you guys, it would have been more. For you guys, it would have been more like a baby crate. I think. Yeah. Call it. Let us That's know. That's a bunch of baby box. We'll, That's right. We'll call in. Hey, Mace. Mace is on. Give us a call, Mace. Give us yeah, a call. 609-800-1003. Are you guys That's happy? 609 Are you guys happy with the money going to a baby box? Baby box. Do you feel that's what our, you know, what our society needs right now is a box to put our child in when we come home? I want my baby box, baby box, baby box, baby box, baby box. I'm serious. I, I want to know what people think. Maybe I'm wrong. Baby box, baby box, baby box. That's what we're done with. Exactly, Craig. If you can't afford children, swallow. That's what I'm saying. Come here. Buddha will give you a BJ's card. You can go down. Or a card for a BJ. And ironically, BJ's. Free boxes. See, everything <laughs> works for a reason. <laughs> wow. You like that? That, that was a good tie. That's good too. You get them at Costco, Costco right? BJ's, free boxes. Sam's Club. I, I and if they're real tiny babies, you can use the little Chinese food to go things. <laughs> <laughs> if you're really hard up, I'm sure you could go to the fucking post office and get a wax box. Those boxes are nice. Hey, they got that $3 dollar box. Fits anything. I'm sure. If it ships, it fits. <laughs> it's it. <laughs> Or if it ships, it fits. I mean, <laughs> if it fits, it ships. That's what I said. <laughs> You're a little bit flexing. That's all right. Don't worry about that's it. <laughs> You're like a fucking soup sandwich today. <laughs> Holy You're Jesus. all fucked up. Don't ever put them in a UPS box, please. They'll pick it up. Yeah, somebody might take it. I'm serious. Babies, this is where our society has gone. We need to send these mothers home that have no clue what to do in a box. They, they don't need a box, these girls. Seriously? Am I wrong? No, Anyone else have an wrong. opinion on this? No, I, I'm done with the boxes. No, I'm st- just, we got an hour show to do. Fuck I'm still the on the box. To another Fuck fucking the box. subject. I got two subjects this week, and then I'm out. That's all right. I can bring <laughs> some shit up. Don't worry about it. Holy Christ! So I was looking for. Um, you ever? You know? You ever guys ever shop on Amazon? This is yeah. hysterical. Hey, did we get to the part of the show where the funny kicks in yet? We were talking about that earlier. We're two I mean, minutes, it's, we're it's, two it's minutes late. It's already after seven. And we're two minutes late. I was waiting for the funny to kick in. We're two minutes late. How are you feeling, Shane? Hey, Penny, how are you doing? We're two minutes late, folks. I might be pregnant, so start oh, saving Jesus. it up and cool. give me a box. Give him a box. Hey, Al, how's it going, pal? I hope you're feeling good. What's up, Al? Could you... Pretty soon we're going to start giving them, like, we can put other items. The family I don't talk there. to? What yeah, else? Brother-in-law. <laughs> He's really cool guy. Really? Man. Oh, Al, Al, Al's a good guy. I love the Al. Al, what's up, brother? You, Al, you, really he misses do, you. Man. Give us a call, man. I, I loved hanging out with you. 609-800-1003. Call. Just, he just, loves to talk to you. Give us a call. We need something to do. Come on, Al. You're killing us. Just pick up the goddamn phone already. Would you just, I mean, really, we need the help. Sorry, I'm back. It's a sh- it's a shame our family uh, or I mean whatever whatever happened happened, but it had nothing to do with you. And it's a shame you can't contact me, but I wish you would. That's all. Mm-hmm. And or you right. could. It's six zero nine eight zero. No, no, no. If he does, my and, and my sister finds out, he'll he'll be living a living hell, man. Well, it's not like anybody's really no, listening to this no, anyhow. So nobody you know, know what I'm saying, right? <laughs> I mean, no, no, no. How, it, it, how's your sister going to find out? Nobody's listening to this. You know why? If somebody ever mentioned that, you know, yeah, no, he'd catch a lot of shit. Believe me, my sister's more fucked up than anything. Hey, really? Oh, man, my family's... Oh, wait a minute, we got to call her. Call her, guys. Call her. Oh, but your fucking sister to save us. No, my sister would never call her. Hey, it's Al. Buddha, who do we got? Buddha Radio, what's up? It's this is your mother. Oh, jeez. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> Happy birthday, Mama. Now we're Tell him I heard him. And I'm calling. Hey, Ma. How are you? Oh, wonderful. I yeah. heard you, so I called you. Can you believe this, that they're giving out boxes to put babies I'm in? Wonderful. Have you ever heard of this? Shut your, shut, shut your sound off your computer, Mom. You, you got to hang up the other phone. I think you're, uh, you're getting feedback. Hang up the other one. And then All right. 
Goodbye. No, you don't have this. You don't have to go. Not this one. Not this one. Not this phone. Hello? Ma. No, don't Hello? go. There you are. Yeah, Ma, not this phone. The Just other the phone. other phone. The other. Are you calling from the other phone? Yeah. Yeah. We'll turn the radio show off on the other phone. And talk to us on this phone. I did. Okay. There okay, there you go. There we go. Right. So, hey, happy birthday. Happy birthday, Ma. Happy Thank birthday. you. I heard Buddha made you a good cake, huh? I've never done this before, but I said, I, he told me to listen, so I heard him say that his go, mother so should call in, so I did. So how old are you, Ma? She's so sweet. 71. Yeah. God bless you. God bless you. 71, all right, Ma. Nice. Way to go. Mom's great, man. I love yep. when she's in the audience at a show. Oh, yeah. She fucking laughs so oh, yeah. great. 71, Ma. I, All right. I'm such a big... I was a big, yep. I was a big kid. Everybody complains and says, I'm surprised food just doesn't fall out of your mom still. That's 71. All right, I'm going. About okay, she's I'm going. She's done. We love you. Thanks, Ma. Hey, Mom, it was Bye. great. Thanks, Thanks Mom. Mom. Hey, Buddha's Mom. She's Buddha's 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 I'm glad to have her. I moved her actually 14 houses away. And I don't know what's going on. I think she's going out partying because I'll call her up to, like, stop. I'm like, Mom, I'm going to stop by. She's like, no, don't worry. Don't bother. It's all good. If I need something, I'll call, you know? She, so today she asked me, she's like, are you going to shop right because I need water? I'm like, no, nah, I'll hook you up. So I hooked her up with some water because it's hard, you know, to carry a freaking 42 bottles of water up and down the stairs. Oh, so yeah. I did it for her. That's we got cool. another caller, guys. I'm a good wow. caller. Oh, two in a row. Real fire. Buddha Radio, go ahead. Who are we talking to on the phone? Live! They're there. Hello? Caller, are you there? Anybody there? Listen to us, not the radio. Hello? They're there. They're still there. They're hey, still there? hello. Do you have a phone number? Yeah, but I can't give it to you. No, you can't give it to me. See, the way, this, the way this works is you talk to yeah, us. Yeah, we talk to you. 732 you Exchange. Us. Hello, you're there. You're on the air. Yeah, they called the wrong number. Okay. This is your pizza. What can I do for you? <laughs> you want to shit? You eat shit. You eat shit. my mother. So, hey, probably, can we talk? She's probably bought, she's trying to call the other line to, to, to listen again. It's a different again. number. And she so, hey, let me ask you a question. Can we, uh, can we talk about uh, Cannibal Night? Is that cool with you? Yeah, I don't care. Yeah? Why not? You you were there, man. You experienced this. Did you go know. already? No, it's 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 uh, May 11th. Oh, you're going to have fun then. Uh, yeah, well, you're going to come, man. I don't think I could go that night. No, it's no, a Thursday I, night, bro. Yeah, I know. I won't be here. You won't be here. What's that? I won't be here. No, I know. I'll be here. And yeah. then I got, you know, things happen. Yeah, I won't be able to make it. Darn. But uh, we're going to talk about this thing. My, my cousin runs this uh, Garfield Unico, and they do a thing called Cannibal Night. You got to come, man. You'd love it. Okay. Dude, it is like 300 guys, and all they do for Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> sounds exciting already. Yeah, they're all sticky. When, at the when end. you when you lead off with it starts it's, with 300 guys. It's 300 you'll love it. Yeah, but you don't let me finish. It's 300 guys, and for four hours, all they do is eat for okay. four hours. Eat and drink. That's it for four hours, and you name it, they make it, and it's called Cannibal Night for a reason. It's all guys, and all they do is eat like cannibals. A lot of self-esteem issues in that room. <laughs> a lot of self-esteem. Yeah. <laughs> L- lot but of it's a great night out. And I, but, but on that night, it's probably a lot of I don't give a fuck. It's what it's, anybody <laughs> thinks. Not, yeah, they, they don't. It's it's at the Brownstone in Patterson. Great food is the food's excellent. excellent though. Yeah, the food is phenomenal. Do they, you do you dabble in the rare foods of of meats of animals? I I will eat anything. Once at least, just well, like to they, say that I tried it. They have rabbit. They have venison. They, I've, yeah, that's yeah. Ever have apuzel? Apuzel? Yeah. I don't. I don't it, think it's, so. It's a lamb's head that they cut this way and open it up and they fucking mix the brains and shit with. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I just saw that on TV. Actually, and then they put it back. No, in. no. But I they have not. They eat it. Good. But I would. It's they good. eat it. I would. I'm not afraid. They it, have everything. I am manly man. It tastes like a. I'm. I'm. a guy. Yeah, it tastes just like chicken. No, it tastes like a soggy meatball, like a a looser meatball. It's good though. It's tasty. It's like, a, you know how you, you tasted eat? it? Yeah, I had it. I never fucking ate it. Oh, it was good. Oh, fuck that! Why? I can't well, eat can you sit, smiling at me. How can you sit here talking about it smiling like, at me and describing yeah, it to me? Your teeth are like this. So it's like, oh, so get the fuck out of here. You won't even eat it. Why are you describing it to me? Because you might like it. 
a what a promoter this guy is. Yeah. He's a great promoter, everybody. <laughs> this guy will fight everybody. He'll, here, have some. I won't touch this <laughs> shit, but have some. <laughs> I don't it's like this, man. Well, hey, what is this first thing you do? When you smell something that's bad. I mean, he's Are really you, selling me on this shit. When you shit. taste something that's bad, what do you do? You look at your girlfriend and you say, here, taste this. No, I don't. I throw it in the garbage because I'm... No, no, I always look at my wife and go, you gotta taste this. Well, that's why You're a sick son of a bitch. Everybody does shit like that. That's why she hates your guts and she's in deep That's why she's having a great time with your grandchild and you're up here sucking your own. You don't tell me you never did that. I met your wife. You never did that. She will tell you to go fuck yourself. You never she tries it. No, she, so now she's getting smart because now she's like, no, I ain't touching that. What do you no, who cares? Why would I want to touch it if it's bad? This I just want to make sure it's bad. It. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. We're getting off topic. we got to talk about the thing that starts with the 300 men and the sheep's head that nobody will touch. That's what we're here to talk about wow, right now. Spike wants oh. to be focused. Really? Holy Christ. Really? We're, we're, just talk, we're talking about you know, fucking oh, Riddlin kicked in. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> He's drinking seven gallons of iced tea. Look at this shit. <laughs> Yeah, don't get his you stuff to be here, huh? You're a pisser! The two of them, I'm gonna have piss all over me when I fucking leave this room. The two of you. Hey, we'll, we'll go to the shower. There's piss bubbles coming across the room. And he's the one that wants to go do the gladiator thing with the 300 boys in the arena. Well, when, no, you guys, the when the two of you guys go to piss together, don't cross the streams, because some crazy Don't shit cross happens. the streams. No, fact, we, got, we got Goomba Johnny. He's going to be a comedian be at that show. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Oh, wow. He was on fire last year. They asked that's him. A, I, actually, that's the show that I want to go see at the Cove Fair soon. i got to pick and choose when I can go, because I usually work weekends, but I want to go uh, get uh, Goomba Johnny. and uh, That's else? April 8th. Go yeah, by Johnny, Vinny Pastor, there you go. Go myself. Put it in yourself. Yeah. I, I didn't like rabbit. Show. Getting back to that, I didn't like rabbit at all. No? no. Like, I'll eat rabbit if it's in a stew. Anyhow, I think I'm going to go to that show. But I, I can't have I can't have there. it with the bones. No one cares. Uh, we don't. Nobody cares. <laughs> I can't eat the bones. No? Yeah, fried alligator was good. Did you eat that? Uh, yeah, that was good. That was awesome. That was like fried alligator, Gene. I don't think you're meant to eat any bones, really. You can't no, eat, you the don't eat the bones. I'm saying I don't want rabbit. you just said you can't eat the bones. I don't want to be served rabbit with the bones. Like, All right, off well, the bone. like I want it meatless. Okay, it's meatless. Well, you, no, no, you want it boneless. You want it meatless. You just want the bones. <laughs> oh, boy, you are <laughs> fucked up. Today. Oh, 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 I actually know what you're saying, but you're I want it meatless. Right. Holy Christ! Just give me the fucking bones. God damn it! I'm fucking cannibal. Give me a meatless I'm rabbit. Cannibal, like, give me the fucking bones. Give me a meatless rabbit. Put it on a she oh, sheep's head. Balls. Pass it around 300. I want it meatless, motherfucker. So I'm a dickless man trying to speak in a fucking dickless world right now. I apologize, but you knew what the fuck I meant. I want I'm rabbit without I'm a dickless boy in a dickless world. It's too gamey for me. They had a lot of birds too, right? What were some of the birds? They had, uh, it's too gay for you. What? Gay. Listen, they oh, just gamey. they do not. You walk in and they got guys making fresh food to know right there in front of you. They got room for hard to do. They got everything. You name it. They did, got. Did you did you see? Uh, oh oh shit! Okay. The, the fresh. I think it was called the Freshman, um, with uh, Marlon Brando and Matthew Broderick. Yeah, yeah, I remember that. Where Marlon Brando was like. Uh, the, it was the exotic foods exactly. or whatever. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Yeah, That's what that reminds but, me of. But he, he never killed an animal. Right. They they, were, they served a fucking chicken. It was supposed to be, yeah, it was they supposed to be an iguana. Shit, yeah. They, they rolled the iguana uh, no, out, the, uh, wheeled them the around. Iguana, it was uh, a dragon. The state Komo Komodo, Komodo dragon. Komodo dragon. The yeah. state of New Jersey should pay me for this two hours that I get. <laughs> the, these two assholes are not out in public on the streets of the fucking New Jersey right now. They're here. So between 6.30 yeah, and 8.30, you guys are all safe on the road. Yeah, I know. He's all safe. He's the one he's all pissed because he never saw it. If he knew what we were talking about, he'd be yelling all about it. Nobody saw the freshman. Nobody saw it. Apparently somebody did. It's a piece of shit movie with fucking three great actors. Nobody saw that fucking movie. You know what? Did you see that movie? No. No. Did you see that movie? No. I didn't. Um... He didn't see it. He's a freshman. He's fucking high right now. He thought I asked him if he was a freshman in college. That's because that's because you were. Never mind. Speaking of high you're right now, fucking, Eddie Clark, if you're you listening, hi, how are you? Shit. Listen, you guys can't cross talk over each other I'm when someone's talking. We're not, we're not crossing the stream. I heard Eddie Clark and Star Wars. I'm all fucked up in my head right well, now. I was talking to you. I don't know what the fuck you're talking about. Gene, am I, I'm, I'm just... I love I'm meatless right now. I'm meatless. I'm, I'm meatless. I'm meatless. <laughs> give me the fucking bones. <laughs> Somebody just give me a meatless rat or a great down. Down. He's too loud in here. No, well... I'm too, I'm too loud like, in here. You so go right there. It's fine. You put 
one ear on, one ear off, you're good. Okay, I hate that's good. Hey, you're I'm, fucking I'm, killing I'm, my ears. I'm used to being on the radio with Craig Lindgren. Yeah. That's the only way to get heard. Yeah, but you don't have to hear. Okay. Yeah, I know, I forget. We, we'll, we'll stop to let you talk. Or It'll at least... Like, you know, like gentle. Gentle. Make you think like we saw. So the cannibal, whatever the fuck, wonderful, great, enjoy. Okay, uh, Anthony, Anthony, Anthony Deep from Primo yourself. wants to know if they, they serve a toast salad. It's not that kind of fucking thing. They, no, they also served... Uh, 300 you, boys and you're worried about getting your salad tossed? Please. <laughs> I'm going to get buttons, so when I push my button, I'm talking, and then yours is off, and then I push it again. If someone is talking already... Sorry. Uh, sorry, Ma. <laughs> What was I saying? I have no clue. Oh, what do you call it? What is the food? Because you're a chef. They had the, uh, the chicken embryos. They had those there, too. Yeah. Pickled chicken embryo. Yeah. That's all it's called. There's no name for it, like like merkin or gherkin. And then they also... Nothing, they, nothing that I've ever heard, but we could, we could make good, it. good, though. They also I have all the food that the uh, Brownstone's famous for, like the rice balls and uh, the mussels and... Uh, clams, because you know, clams on a half shell, clams. I don't like raw clams. More clams than everything, you know what the fuck they're with. Afraid of those. Every different I love raw right. clams, raw yeah. oysters. It if I, if bring you make it, I'll eat it. The mussels in, in the yeah, red and the green sauce. Just be me buying it and opening it up. That's all it is. <laughs> but I mean, I appreciate that. Thank you very <laughs> much. The, the I don't know what goes into it, but I was hoping you, you know, caught it yourself. <laughs> but like I was saying, it, it, it's four hours. That's all they do. See, when you tell me you're a chef, yeah, I expect you're going out to catch the food and you prepare fucking. You're not defrosting shit and telling me you made it. See, that's not a chef to me. You sit there and watch like the Travel Channel and jerk <laughs> off, don't you? Well, I do. You watch like guy Ant- Anthony Zimmer. And no, I don't like him. But I like the guy that goes and does the food man versus food or whatever. Oh yeah. <laughs> oh my god, I was watching it last week. Do you guy, see him? You see him since. The no, show he, began. He he's like he's like he's he lost two people. Yeah, he's skinny now. He's oh yeah, the show. Yo, he's he thinner had, uh, than me. I mean, he I, had, he I had got really the skinny. same surgery you had. Yeah, it's man versus. Stomach. Oh, did he have? That's did he have the? Yeah, but how does he? He well, doesn't see, eat anymore. No, well, show's no, over. No, but yeah. see, there's another one. There's another one. They started with another chubby guy. They just call it something else, so it doesn't sound the same. It's not man versus. But it is the same thing. I see him, but it's this guy, and he goes out. Hamburger. That was the. It would, they should call it manhole cover. The fucking thing. Yeah, yeah. It looked like Uncle Buck. Remember that movie where he's making pit? That's how big this burger was. It was ridiculous. Hey, Nobody you know, watched that movie. Want to know something? <laughs> there is a guy out there, and I'm telling you, <laughs> no bullshit. My 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 cousin. It's his friend. He lives in Long Beach Island. All right. This guy. <laughs> Nobody can, lives in Long Beach. No. This guy can fucking eat. Yeah. Oh, I'm not shitting you. I got this one guy can fucking eat. Better you ready not. for this? You know what I'm just looking at you, you everybody you fucking know about. <laughs> okay? Yeah. This guy I'm just saying, not right? only ate the steak and the ba- you know, the baked potato, all the, the salad, I mean the, everything. He he's ate it all too, right? He ate it all, right? He's not real skinny. He's he's kinda husky, uh-huh. but not real big, okay? Um his name's Burt, man. He's a great guy. But check this out. Burt. He not only ate all this shit, right? But then the three people that were eating with him to show off. He had three Texas Wiener all the way oh, afterwards. That's crazy. To wash it down with. Yeah, I can't. This I guy can eat. I would have. Big, I, I was five hundred pounds. I paid rent before I fucking. I never ate like that in my life. I never did. So I. I'm he ain't trained. What fully loaded hot play, dogs is I that? Used, it? I used to play cards. Up, I think after, we, after the steak. I used to, yep. No I shit. punch him in the face just on principle. Dude, dude, dude. What the fuck you eat a steak for? With all the trimmings, and, and then, then you, you have, have a hot, hot dog. dog. I used to play cards with the guy every Wednesday night where we would get together. We play cards, right? We would order pizza. Okay, he could have a. He could be in a, a pot. It could be fifty bucks in the pot. All right, and and he's got the winning hand. Pizza shows up, he folds. Goes catch pizza. Uh, <laughs> no, I'm not shitting you. I would have. That's I am not shitting you. That's because he has a million fucking hands. Fifty bucks worth the pot. I would, have, I would have to deliver it every 20 minutes. <laughs> and he ran to the door as soon as it rang. I, I, I told my cousin was busting my balls when he told me this, but then I, I started to notice it. That's the story I heard. Every, every time the pizza showed up, he'd just fold. <laughs> I was like, holy shit. I, I fold my pizza. Too. I, used to, I used to try to time my you, hand. Have you, tried to, have you tried to reverse fold? When the pizza showed have up. Have you tried to reverse fold? I pulled the shit out of that pot just to try to get it. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah. We, saw it, we saw it on the TV. Wait, reverse fold? Yeah. So you get the cheese first. So you get a bite. So you bite in the cheese first yeah, instead but the whole of the point crust. Is to fold it is so that you, your hand doesn't so get a mess. Right, but you just fold it the other way. Hand still doesn't get a mess. Your hand still doesn't get a mess. What happened? Because it just fucking down blew the my side. mind right now. It just blew my mind. I look, so instead of going a U Listen, fold, I got a lot of Pollocks in my life. 
What's that? <laughs> Instead of folding it like a U, holding it like this, right. fold it like a V. You V yeah. fold it. So when you bite it, you're you you're you're, you're, ta you're tasting all the toppings and the cheese and everything. I fucking hate my life. Before before you're tasting <laughs> a mouthful of crust, <laughs> so you get <laughs> like the. This is the what are you talking? You talking about <laughs> pizza? <laughs> yeah, you're reverse. Yeah, thanks for <laughs> thanks for joining us. <laughs> for those of you just joining us, like John Conti, yes. we're talking That's about pizza talking about. right now. I don't understand what he means by reverse. Yeah. Fold. I mean, that was we gotta order a pizza. Okay, okay do you understand what fold means? Okay, do you understand what the word reverse means? I don't get it. Okay, so this is a piece of pizza. So in other words, it's and, not, it's and, not and a this word. is a piece of pizza. No. You fold it like this. Yes. Instead of going like this. So no, no, I understand. You fold it like, you fold it you fold it like that. Yes. yes. Yeah, Inverse fold. Do you, do you know why you have a regular fold? You know what the regular fold is right. for? Like you would fold it like this. Yes. Show the camera so people can see. They can't They're see. folding it like this, everyone. Yeah. Okay, that's the pizza. You fold it the other way. Yeah, but do you know do you know why the they had the regular fold? No, don't yeah, to hold all that grease and shit. Yeah, to, to soak up the grease. Yeah, pour it out. Okay, but okay, but the reverse fold, then you got grease all over. Yeah, hi, Domino's. You, yeah, you, listen, you I ordered a fucking pie a with everything plate. on it. Same as you do I reverse fold it. There's nothing on the pie now. It's all on the plate because it fell off. Because these jerk offs don't know the gravity. The fuck you gonna eat a pie? I eat it regular with everything on it and reverse fold. It don't wrong. fall off. It all sticks to the cheese in this shit. It sticks to the. What are you like, fucking order? And first of all, when you equate, I like Domino's. I I, I eat Domino's That's frequently. Right, I'll probably be eating Domino's tonight. However, when do you equate Domino's with actual pizza? Okay, two different things. Said Domino's. There's Domino's and then no there's pizza. Said Domino's. So you said Domino's a few minutes ago. What I meant so is what, hey, what happened? Okay, well, you? what you meant, what you said. Say what you mean, mean what you say. That's all I'm trying to so say. This is for well, plain pizza, right? Yeah, well, this is for yeah. You don't yeah. let you fucking talk. There should be a warning. Then. Yeah. How many years? Oh, I don't. <laughs> That's like wiping your ass, putting the paper here, and wiping with your hand and going. It's still good. And then wiping on the paper. I don't, wait, wait, wait. I'm, I'm trying to say you're wiping with your own ass backwards. What, what stops all the cheese and shit from sliding into your fucking mouth? You know, even when you bend it the regular way. I'm not high enough for this. Holy shit. Look, my dick just died. Holy My Christ. dick just died. Look at this. What happened? Hanging mighty low. I, I don't know. Swing low. Swing your chair. Uh, you know what? <laughs> Swinging, huh? I don't get the reverse fold. I, I don't care. I don't care. I don't get foreskin on a penis like either. <laughs> no, there's no reason for that. Oh, but reverse. You're good with that. Get the hell away from me. I don't even know you anymore. It's like I can't. Don't walk behind me anymore. I don't trust you. Hey, I'm not the one that's. Don't trust anyone that eats pizza folding it the other way. I'm not the one that keeps pushing this party with 300 naked men in, a, in an arena eating uh, raw vegetable, boneless, boneless uh, rabbits. Wait, wait a minute. If if you're what you're saying about the pizza is right, yeah, can you do that with a cheesesteak? Yeah, why don't you just reverse fold the fucking cheesesteak? It's fun. Yeah, yeah enjoy. You're hot. No, yeah. that's an inside out sandwich. Kind of that's, that's the same scenario. scenario. No, 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 it's no, no, no. It's not the same scenario. No, it's not. No, it's not. You're shutting the sandwich. No, it's not. If you if you turn a sandwich inside out, all the stuff from the sandwich well, falls out of it. So man. tell me something. This is baked on top. You know what I'm curious about? Baked on top of a pizza. I want an answer to this question. So how after how many joints did you and your son smoke that you guys decided, hey, let's bend the pizza this way? Hey, hey that's pretty fucking good. Actually, actually, it was on. Actually, we got it off of one of them television shows that you guys are so enamored with. What show was this? I don't know, but it was one of them Travel Channel shows that you guys sit and. At home and watch and masturbate too. That uh, it was on. Chill, chill. If women are out there are wondering what happens when you drink alcohol while you're pregnant, <laughs> this you get fucking a 50 year old grown up folding pizza the wrong way. <laughs> the wrong way. Yeah, there, is no, there, is no right way. there is no right way. There is no right way. You know what it sucks is when you ever bite into it and all the fucking cheese slides out. <laughs> You're like, what you're, with the upside you're, down fold? you don't know what to do. You're like, you're trying to shove it back here's in. Your, here's your coffee. Hope it doesn't spill. Here you go. Yeah, drink I it put the lid. Down. Instead of it being on the top, it's on the bottom as a cup holder. Enjoy. It works. You <laughs> reports have no vision. Vision. I can no see. vision. I, don't, I can see. I don't need vision. I don't want spike vision. You know what spike vision is? I'll ask you if you can't. You go in the pool with your eyes open for four hours and then you come out and look at the sun. I want to know how much you smoked vision. when you came up with this. <coughs> I told you it was on a TV show. I think you fucking but you hallucinated it. it. But you did it. 
You you yeah. did you did more than smoke a pot that night. I did it. Cause you were hallucinating. Cause I'm a rebel. I, don't I get did it. it. I folded my pizza upside down because I'm a rebel. Why did you just have make it upside down? Jen, can you? Je, we just Jennifer Loigren. I mean, she's saying we're loud. We must be fucking irate. Holy loud. Christ! Right. So she's got Craig in the house. Holy Christ! We're loud. Yeah, For Jen said, to call anything said, loud, that it's that it, it just passed the the level of the uh, testosterone. I want to try something, guys. Let's see. <laughs> All right, now talk into the microphone. Okay. Is this good? Wow, I didn't hear him. It works, guys! <laughs> That's the best way to hear Spike is through a reversed microphone. <laughs> maybe, take, maybe you have the whole show turned up too much? I now take your penis out and put it in your asshole more. and go fuck yourself. I was, I was going to take the microphone. Is that better? Oh my god. Hey, hey oh why don't you tell me? So Richard Brokaw, seriously. Who? Don, Don, Don said to, 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 why don't you turn your why? fucking headphones inside out? Is anyone eating <laughs> reverse pizza? Yeah, just like, there are articles about it. I'm reading. There's articles. Yeah. There's <laughs> actual <laughs> articles about it. Alright, and this guy wants enough with the fucking pizza. On what? Like, uh, what? Right. Stone.com, right? <laughs> Stoners.com. Yeah. That okay. may be. The website is not the important part. The, the website is based out of California, by the way. I'm just letting you know. Where? Marijuana is legal. Where, where we're also in syndication, right? On some radio show. Yeah, you guys Demented like radio. Or Absolutely. Yes, Craig. Yes. Everyone talks at the same time. It's because he's used to being on your show and where has to just yell and he thinks it gets louder. He doesn't realize I have headphones on and I can only hear as loud as the mic can get. He's in that reversed audio world. You know what? Gene, you got to turn his mic down. That's I all. I did. I turned everything down. He no, his mic. I, th- I think we're I think we're like in a Bizarro Superman episode or something because everything's got to be reversed now. I don't know, but I'm fucking sweating on the outside. Yeah, actually, my shirt. you know what? <laughs> what do you got? I'm like in a positive five. Uh, uh, they're gonna make it a five. See what happens. Oh, uh, that's good. You know, do it the backwards thing. Instead of a positive five, give them a negative five. This even works. It's ridiculous. Anyway, oh. give us a call. So I was trying to talk about this. Amazon thing. Uh, what about you know it? how you ever go shopping I thought we were on talking Amazon? About baby boxes. We did. Oh, okay. It's over. <laughs> it's over now. If you turn the box upside down and put them on the did outside. Did you turn my mic down or off? He told me to lower it. Maybe fall out. Who's no, mic? Well, no, everyone's I'm headset not, I'm, not, I'm, not, I'm not saying you shouldn't turn it. I was just asking. Yeah, lower it. It was a question. Yeah, I lowered it. Who okay. told you to lower it? John. All right, it's Buddha Radio. First of all, <laughs> everyone relax. <laughs> I'll fucking have everyone's mic off. Lights out. Turn that shit on. You guys, do you guys shop out there on Amazon? On the Amazon? Anybody? Amazon.com? On the yeah. interwebs, yeah. You ever go and buy something and it's like, people who have bought this have looked at this and that? Yeah. Has. So I was looking for a TV stand for this, uh, <laughs> for this t- uh, TV. For the TV. And yeah. uh, this thing came up for this... Uh, Hammock and swing? No, it's, it was a picture of a little phone. And I, I clicked on it. And it says... Some of the review. I was reading a review on this phone. It's a. Um, I don't even know the name of this phone here. It's a Zanko phone. I don't know. Can you see how small it is? I see how small it is. Uh, one of the things says that it says. Um, uh, kind of like your very small and easy backslash painless to hide. <laughs> what does that mean? Wow. So I'm I mean, guessing a lot of women are sticking them up their ass and putting their boyfriends. It's it's, right. it's a popular right. phone for the prisoners. Right. Yeah. So there is a phone now that you can hide in your ass, ladies and gentlemen. This is where our country has come to, and our technology is now making it's comfortably in your asshole. You yeah, right? I guess this thing's a whole too meaning to. Sorry, I butt dialed you. <laughs> My service. Or you're talking out your ass. Yeah. <laughs> yeah that's a good one too. I got shit service. <laughs> <laughs> That's a good one. I like that. You like that? I like that. I got shit service. You Everyone... shit all over my conversation, didn't you? Prisoners are buying these tiny mobile phones on Amazon and hiding them in themselves. Hiding them with in themselves. Point, with a point six six inch screen. You know what we call that Your wife knows all about that. I would love to. Um, see, I would love to see one of the batteries blow up. One of the fucking things. <laughs> that would be hilarious. You ever seen the one with the guy who had the, the phone in his pocket and the battery blew? Wait, this no. guy, this guy is concerned. It, it was a, uh, sorry, but God, what? It, it was a, a footage from uh, security. Oh yeah, he those, worked uh, at a store. He was standing by the register. Phones, the batteries exploding. Yeah, he had the phone in his pocket. All of a sudden, his, his pants started like sparking and shit. Oh yeah. 
Could you imagine one of your them prisoners? <laughs> <That's> <laughs> awesome. Let's <laughs> right. see that battery go, huh? One customer writes, very small and easy Wait, backslash right. painless to hide, but he is concerned that this model isn't 100% plastic, so it won't beat the boss, which is to say it may not be undetected. The metal by, detector? Yeah, body uh, orifices scanners. <laughs> oh, hey, we must be being listened to by somebody in a prison because he was Bubba saying that. Hey, man, that was funny. <laughs> I don't know. He gives the phone just one star, as most people will want a phone like this for a certain purpose. <laughs> the, the theory of men that we're talking about. <laughs> it may have been a little funny. <laughs> that shit wasn't funny, man. This it is a funny. theory of men that we're talking about. This guy wrote <laughs> five star review. Easy on backslash in the butt. <laughs> Just got out of prison. This phone saved my life. I made over $18,000 in prison just being able to use this phone. I had my girlfriend sneak it in using her vagina, and then it was a I was able to put it in my butt with no problem. Only one time did I almost get busted. One of the guards asked if that was my ass was ringing. From then on, I put it on. Vibrate! <laughs> the phone is so small, you never know. It's sitting in your colon. In fact, now that I'm a free man, and so... He misses it. I used to be in my butt. I just called it there. <laughs> That's not for real. Now nah, that's some hardcore you, you customer loyalty. You wrote that shit, you? No, that's I some that's hardcore customer real. loyalty. Yeah, oh, I'm, I'm a free that's man, and you. I still feel like putting that phone in my ass. It's just fabulous. Yeah, I I'm love a, that phone. I'm a free man, and I miss it so Wait much. Wait a minute. Did you just lift up your ass and fart? No, man. That's called waiting and shit. <laughs> Excuse me. I got another call coming in. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's funny. Now, do they have Bluetooth for that phone? Yeah, they got Bluetooth. I don't know. It's <laughs> No, it's more like a brown tooth. <laughs> there you go. In my cavity. Or, or, or a brown eye. How funny would that be? I put a Bluetooth in my cavity. <laughs> you like that? Oh, Sorry, I was freaking. Oh, this Falcon show came to a full turn. <laughs> <laughs> we got people hiding phones in their asses. Give we us a call. People eating pizza reverse. Now, let me ask you a question. <laughs> if you're telling me there's no right way to hold a pizza, why are you saying it's reverse? You're admitting it's backwards. No, it's not reverse. It's an inverse fold. Inverse. You either fold it or you fold it inversely. Well, inverse would mean the other way, which means versely is the correct way. <laughs> inversely, no, versely is, the, is the is the standard way. Is the way that most people, it, the the way you fucking sheep that will follow anything that you're told do. Okay, you inverse know. inverse in, implies maybe a little thought. Maybe a little man of action. Maybe a little somebody that wants to do something just a little different outside the norm. You know what I'm saying? No, I'm thinking that was mostly by somebody really high. They folded it the wrong fucking way and went, Whoa, check it out. I'm eating my pizza in reverse. <laughs> yeah, look at him. <laughs> First of all, you thick-skinned moron. It's inverse, not reverse. Say it with me. Inverse. Well, what would inverse, reverse be? Inverse. Eating the crust first? Is that like I don't know. It could be. That's for those stuffed crust faggots. That's not even real pizza. That's like something else. Yeah, but like he said, oh. how, how does the cheese hold it up when it's so hot? It's We're just back like, at the pizza, everyone. <laughs> I had to. How does, it, how does it fucking, you know, not I'm fall all over the place? Can you answer that? You know what's funny? Yeah, Would you eat it cold? It, it just sticks it on. Cold. You know, you know what's funny? Story. Cheese falls off when you try to eat it. Just fold it regularly. How do you, that's what we're asking. Yeah, exactly. Well, it's piping hot. Wait a fucking wait five minutes. I'm going to have an order. Have you, a you, like no, it's okay. You could have said, wait a fucking minute. That's don't, what you were going to say. It's all right. We're all like, grown-ups here. Don't you like eating your food? I like hot pizza. Hi, yeah. Is this Vinny's? Yeah, I'd like to order a large cheese pie, but could you send it to me inversely? Yeah, and also yeah. don't eat and it. And make it cold. <laughs> make sure the guy yeah. delivers it cold. Wait five minutes before he comes to the door. I don't want a hot. I don't want a hot fucking pizza. Wait five fucking minutes outside the driveway. I'll tip him. Don't worry about it. I want it cold. So I can invertedly do you fucking pull the fucking thing. Do you pay by credit card? You're that asshole swiping. Like you got the card inversely. You need to put it the other way. Yeah, but the driver had one of those new ass phones, so I had to slide the credit card down his ass. He had a chip. Nice. He had a chip, so he had to stick it up his ass. <laughs> Would you like a receipt, sir? Yes, no, please. No, no. <laughs> That's the new card readers. In the I'm, so, I'm sorry, has it got the chip? Oh, you don't slide it. You got to stick it in. I ain't slide my card for another five fucking minutes. Fuck you. I want cold pizza. We're ordering a pizza the next show. <laughs> <laughs> I'm 
proper way to eat it inversely. I told you before, there's no proper way to eat it. Oh, oh hey, listen, I gotta if tell you. If it gets in you, it's I proper. I play, I play the trick. <laughs> That's not always true either. Well, true. <laughs> but sometimes you gotta pay extra I for that. I like cold cheese. I like hot cheese. I'm baffled. You know, it's I'm not like. You can't do it to Sicilian then. Only foldable pizza? Right, no, only for fold. Right. Only you foldable. Fold you Why would you slice? fold a non-foldable pizza? How the fuck do you open your mouth? We were talking about folding fold Sicilian slice right. in your mouth. Oh, kind of like a piranha. Are you really? Like, how wide can your mouth open? My son's getting upset. He's getting pissed. He's he talking about folding a Sicilian pie now. What the fuck is wrong with you? Uh, how the fuck do you fold a Sicilian slice? He's, he's, he's the one that brought it up. But he got, they let them wait five minutes. He's going back. <laughs> what do you order? We're ordering pizza, folks, oh, so stay tuned. <laughs> We're going to get crazy. We're going to fold the info. We're going against, against the government. That's it. Let's get We're gonna fold nuts. it the other way. Let's get crazy. Get We're going to fold it inversely. It's going to be Make huge. Make sure you don't come it's for five huge. minutes after it's made. It's going to be huge. It's we don't be want huge. it. Everybody, huge. Everybody in the way, everyone in the country is going to be eating their pizza this way now. <laughs> grab your pizza by the... We're gonna, so listen, I got to say... He's funny. I, I you played. didn't hear that. I, I you grab your pizza by <laughs> the pussy. I like that. <laughs> I don't get it. He's like father like son, huh? Oh, yeah. Oh yeah. oh, yeah. So I played a trick on a buddy of mine. Did you? Okay, yeah. You know the two fucks I bought? Mm -hmm. Okay, I put all, like, records that I had and everything in it. And I made up the labels. Because there's a free program, you know, just, you know. So, in the 70s, they were, you know, they were in a band. And they, they cut a 45. So I made up the label. Label for... And I put it in there. And I put the actual, the 45 is in, in the jukebox. It, it sounds good. I mean, it's from the 70s. It was really cool. But uh, I took a picture of it. <laughs> I said it to him. I was like, hey, look what I found. And it was like, the, the name of the band was The Holes. Or he said The Holes, and the, the, their hit was Ain't No Drag. And he's like, where the fuck did you find this? <laughs> I mean, he hasn't seen that in probably 30 years, you know. It was a good trick. It was, you had, I guess you had a beat here. Yeah, Apparently. You made his day, didn't you, John? <laughs> you made his day. Yeah, we probably did. It was cool, you know. But, uh, yeah, it's my He's first giving time. me shit about the way I eat pizza. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, there's nothing wrong with that. Not all stories are going to be winners, bro. Yeah, really. You hang around long, John long enough, you're going to hear uh, whatever I'm saying. I, just eat <laughs> <laughs> I inversely what, eat my what you? <laughs> yum, yum, eat him up. Yum, yum, eat him up. If you stick around him long enough, you'll hear something funny. Is that what you were trying to no, say? No, I said you'll. I don't even know. <laughs> it doesn't matter. Anyway, we got Oreo eggs this week, guys. Oreo eggs. Try. Yes, this is a new product here. A dollar each for these things, okay? Kind of Holy Christ. Yeah, it looks like Saturn. They saw you coming, didn't they? Look at it. Dollar. Yeah, I don't know what it is. It, it's, uh, it's a cream-filled candy with cookie pieces. And they've come out with, like, a new... You want one? I'll go check. I don't know. They've come out with a new way to open these. Check these out. It's got, like, this ribbon on the side. And I guess you separate it. So not only have we come out with a new thing that's going to be a hit, because believe me, these were the last five on the show. It's a chocolate egg. So it was like, it, they're like rib. Oh, it's a look at that. So, so they're like. It's a chocolate egg, everybody. They're so like this is going to be like a Cadbury egg. Rib for, like, for our pleasure. Oh. It's rib for her pleasure. It's rib for our pleasure. No, once you open it, you eat once it. Once you open it, you don't open it. What are you going to save it for later? Yeah, I was going to do that, but no. uh, it's not like the You movie. broke the seal. It's not like the Chinese thing. Don't be all gay and stuff. Just eat the fucking thing. Oh my god. I, I'm like, really? No, Oreo? I can't. My wife is watching me. I had the yodels and shit, you know? <laughs> that was the other day. I know. I thought she was done watching. Oh know. my god. Is it good? On. Joanna, are you on? <laughs> oh, so it's a Cadbury egg, basically, right? It's a Cadbury egg filled with like, uh. It's like speaking of semen. You ever have Kinder? No, I've never been on Tinder. No. <laughs> Soy fried bun. That's fucking gross. The yeah, okay, it's gross. It's all chocolate. Holy shit, guys. I don't like the inside. Oh my god. You like it? I can't even talk. <laughs> no, you can't. Mm -mm. Holy shit. <laughs> hey, Jen, you, Jen, you should buy a lot of these, Jen. Throw them in Fred's face. Holy crap. Those are good, man. Yeah. Holy shit. Here, keep yeah. this one. Yeah, I'll keep that one. <laughs> Friends, it won't do what you gotta throw it out there. <laughs> I will. Put it right there for now. 
Take it to the man cave day with you, the cannibal. Man cave day. Cannibal. <laughs> man cave day. <laughs> You're a fucking wackadoo. I'll tell you what, man. Ask Booty. He was there. He had a good time. <laughs> ask him. Ask him. Fast. I was can yeah. ask him. It was good, man. Yeah. They, have, right. they have normal stuff there, like, come on. And, yeah. Mm -hmm. I mean, I'll eat the other stuff, like the rabbit and everything, because I'm not afraid of a meatless Right. No, I'm just saying, it's, it's, it's a great night out. It's 85 bucks a, a ticket. The rabbit. money goes to a good cause. Unico does a lot of things Holy for, crap. You, know, pe you know, people in need and everything. And that's what it's for. So you, you can actually write it off. These are good guys. Is Oreo, is Oreo good? eggs, man. Get them. Oreo eggs. They're good, good man. They ain't worth a dollar. Fucking listen to John. He eats fucking, they you know. Suck. He eats half a fucking White Castle and has to puke it up. <laughs> yeah, it's a real, real good fucking stomach you got going on there. Hey, man, you know. I avoid it per. I would never do that. Fuck that. I haven't eaten White Castle since the last time. At an airport, I, I, I had to run to the airport the other day. And so ran past the White Spike Castle. Spike put one of the eggs <laughs> up his oh. ass. <laughs> <laughs> Anthony DePremio. Oh, nice. oh, that's fucking great. <laughs> yeah, Anthony on last week. I gotta add you to my website, bro. Oh, that's Jersey Anthony Brewers. Is it Anthony who said that? Yeah, he goes. <laughs> he didn't spell your name right. What's up, Anthony? Spike. Don't spike to smuggle one of those eggs in your ass and make a collect call to Nabisco <laughs> on a mini prison phone. I don't know. It was funny in the first two I, lines. No, I, I, I oh, appreciate I, that. I, Thank you, Anthony. You I made it funny. Like, you I strung like had. a bunch of shit together. It shows He's a real fat attention. guy, though. That guy knew Nabisco made Oreo. Like, he fucking was just like, yeah, I'm going to call that motherfucker. Yeah, he knows. I'll call him on that shit. <laughs> Listen, guys, this is probably a limited time, so get your eggs. These are awesome, bro. I liked it. It's really, really, really good. You didn't like it? I, I thought it sucked dick. It. Not in a nice way, either. <laughs> it was not that good. I liked it. Two out of three. I liked it. Two out of three. All right, Don't two, like it. Two out of four. Two, I, I, did, like I did like it, yeah. He liked it. Right. A little sweet, but it's not bad. His wife doesn't feed him, though. But yeah, some you can't go by him. <laughs> if it's edible, he eats like it. Mikey. Give it to Mikey. Give it to Gino. Give it to him. Oh, my God. Give it to Gino. How many want to it? call in? It's free. He'll eat anything. If you want to call in, call in at 609-800-1003. That's 609-800-1003. One zero zero three. Operators are standing by. Call in now. Yeah, give us a call. And we'll talk about anything you want to talk about. I remember my friend, remember my friend Janet when she called. She wanted to know how come guys couldn't pee in a, a toilet. <laughs> yeah. They always peed on the side. And yeah. Everything else. That I was, remember. That was that. a lot of fun. That was. That was. Uh, give us a call. We'll I'm talk surprised about you remember anything. that show. I remember that show. That was a yeah? good show. Was I here it was a good show. show. I th I think you were here. I don't think so. No, no, I don't think. I, I don't think remember. I was, I was oh no, that was you. yeah you. That was that was you and me that night. Yep. I don't yeah. know how. I don't know. I've just started standing. That, that show right actually standing turned out pretty good. That was a good how. show. It was a yeah. lot of fun. It was good because I wasn't here. No, um, that wasn't the reason. It was just it was a good. Yeah, it, it was wasn't the reason. Call. It was one of the reasons, but not the reason. It was a very good oh. phone call. Yeah, I it, I've just started to pee standing up again. Did you really? No, I haven't been able to see it, so I'm not going to just hope that it's going in the toilet. Okay, that, well, that's fair. That's, that's yeah, fair. So now I can see it, and I piss right on the floor. Nice. <laughs> <laughs> no, I... I, I piss on the floor like a man, like I meant to. Uh, <laughs> we have no control over that fucking ape. Not for no, the first just twelve. Goes. Not for no. the first tenth of a second. Uh, right. no. You can't cut it off like a woman. No. Fuck no. What can hurt you? You try squeezing it, and that's it. That's it. it. No. Oh. Women can cut it off like that, man. You try squeezing it, you're gonna wind up pissing on the walls. Why can't you cut it off? What? You could cut your piss off real quick. Yeah, if I had to. Oh, oh, somebody's coming. Oh yeah. No way. It's called uh, youth. You wanted them he shoes? It's called youth. Youth. No, 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 no. You got two youths. You mean as, 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 as you get older, you can't stop your piss? I don't have a problem with it. I don't know. Well, the... listen, as long as my balls don't touch the water yet, I'm fucking fine, okay? <laughs> that happens sometimes. Yeah, you gotta get... They should make, like, a sling or something. I don't know. They should make toilets deeper, I think. <laughs> the ball's ear. The ball's ear? There you go. The ball's... He's a genius. He is. The ball's ear. I think we're, we're gonna, gonna have him on so like much fucking pot. Hey, it's unreal. <laughs> I, I, I told him that. Before. I wish I was actually, your actually, actually, no, like actually, 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 he was. Before we he go was any further, moves. yeah, you got like old person cum on your lip. Let's wipe it off. <laughs> like a fucking, it looked like a grit or something. It was like that Oreo sh 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 spooge. Did it. See. <laughs> Anyhow, so the, so the boy's making a move on this girl today, and and it was mainly due to you know his sense of humor, and I said, nice. well, you should have said. 
you know, check me out. I'll be on the radio today. How old are you now? He's 19. 19. Oh, yeah. Ah, to be 19 again. I wish I was 19. Holy crap. I would have been a plastic surgeon. I would have been a plastic surgeon. In California. Surgeon. I'm serious. <laughs> I've been sending postcards to here. Hey, enjoy the Buddha radio. I don't know why you named it after me, but thanks. <laughs> So what do you got going on? Anybody got? I got a. Uh, I'm in New Egypt again, at a firehouse. What? Friday. I think Friday. Or this Friday? Friday? I'm horrible. That would be tomorrow. No, Saturday. Saturday. Yeah. Who are you there with? That's a Ginger Ninja. What's up, Craig? Craig's back. So everyone knows. Ginger Ninja. Who do we got in the chat room here? I got a couple people. Got Don Corby. He said he was leaving, but he's still here. Lion bitch. Lion bastard. Hey, what's up, Don? What I want to know is when you're on Facebook Live and you share it all over the place and then you go into a certain one, are all the comments in one, like all one feed together? Everybody's feed's different. See, that's horrible. We need to fix that. Oh, that felt good. Someone has a phone in their ass. That's, that's <laughs> Zippy over there. Yeah, he, he always no, it's, it, it gets, you know, people message me. You always say, uh, you know, not to message them. We're getting thumbs up. We're getting hearts. Are we? People are liking people, us. People, people are hearting us? It came to a tense. They're going to heart us. Right now. And, and, and liking us. They won't wow. call in, but you know. So what else is going on, man? I'm out of subject. We got a, we got a, <laughs> done. We got in a second show up in Greenwood Lake. We know that. Um, we knew that last week. You knew that, but there are some audience might know that. They knew it. I don't know. Is it early or later? Earlier? I think, I think it's earlier. I was going to try to stop by, but it's two hours away. Yeah, no, no, you're in two hours away. That's you know. Don't worry, we'll we'll get over it. Oh. We'll, <laughs> we'll get over it. We'll get over it. You know, you're not being. When there, is so. it? When when is that show? The 18th. Yeah, I'm not. It's, uh, yeah, March yeah. 18th. Greenwood Lake, New York, at the uh, old Castle Tavern called the Cove Castle now. Or Castle Cove. Which one? Castle uh, Cove. Castle, Castle Cove. Cove? Yes. And uh, great, great. They added a second show. They're, they're every really every, happy every week about we it. go through this. You, you say, is it this or this? And, and, I, and I correct I, you. I, and I, I, I have a problem. I'm such not even involved in the show, and I know. <laughs> no, no. I have like, such a problem with that shit. Like, I'm, I'm going to start charging you guys to advertise. <laughs> Like the way he's talking tonight, that's yeah. that's how I see things. Yeah. Fucked up. Oh. Rever inverse. Rever Inversed. <laughs> I mean, for for fucking fifty years of my life, I called it the Castle Tavern. Okay, you called it a castle. You called it now it's the Castle Cove. Okay, fair or enough. Cove Castle, whatever. I don't know. Well, I'm just trying to get it straight so that people know where to go because well, they, they were worried. We want them to go to the they show. They called. They were like, oh man, we haven't had really uh, twenty calls and this that and the other thing. And I'm like, listen, relax. You know, it's a month before the show. And then all of a sudden you're you know, adding a second show. And now last week they called me up and they're freaking out. Yeah, we got <laughs> We got to add a second show. Yeah, they just got to relax. Let it happen. Yeah, it, it, accept it. Don't know. be fresh. And, and, and let the coolness And he's being really cool. I mean, the owner is a really cool guy. We tease you. Is, uh, just a tip. We don't put the whole thing in because you can't handle the whole thing. No way. But, yeah, uh, I couldn't. I don't miss him enough to put the whole thing. Yeah, he, uh, he wants to. He's doing this thing called uh, Cabin Fever for the locals. Like to get out of the house. It ain't three hundred guys in a room, is it? No. Okay. So it's Eddie Jeff Clark. Clark. Eddie Clark's. Oh, great. Eddie Clark. Fucking great, man. I feel bad. I gave him the shits like the last month. <laughs> you're you're hung up on that. I dude. I'll, I'll tell you. You don't know how much I laughed. I was the only one that didn't touch that thing. I didn't eat any of it, man. I, I'm <laughs> lucky because I missed that but, show, and probably the only reason I didn't eat any of that. I tell you what. The, the funniest thing about it was Eddie was flying. No. Right. The next day, no, he was I know. flying. I know. So to have the shits and be on a fucking airplane, that's, that's hilarious. That is the worst. That is hysterical. Yeah. And, and it's all his fault. <laughs> I think it's my hilarious. fault. It's Rob Irvine's fault. I, I oh, thought it was hilarious, but you know. I mean, I feel bad for him, but it's still hysterical. <laughs> all right. But if you're out there listening somewhere, Mr. Eddie, hello. Hello, Eddie. We Eddie's a big friend that. big friend of the show. Eddie actually yeah. listens to the show, aside from he coming just on. Said, Fuck you, I quit. I'm not coming on the 18th. <laughs> <laughs> Anybody see, uh, I want to see that Logan movie, man. That shit looks good. It made a lot of money already. The Wolverine movie? Oh, yeah? Yeah. I've, I've heard it was actually the best of the... Really? The well, that's, Wolverine I got movie. lost in that, But man. then again... I love the Men of X, man. I love that. The, the, that's the one that's on HBO now, right? Huh? It's in the movies. There's like there's like twelve X Men movies. Yeah, I know, and I get mixed up with them. I mean, it's nine like, of them are Wolverine. They, they try to be, yeah, they try to make like money. <laughs> I am <understand laughs> money. The whole point of a fucking movie. The word you're looking for is money. No, I'm just saying. I understand you're making money, but oh. it's it's like you're telling the story here, and then you're going off on a, on a tangent over here about this one. 
and you're going off on a tangent over here about another one. It's like, wait a minute. Now, what am I here to watch? Am I here to watch a continuation of the guy with the fucking steel fingers? Or am I here to see a continuation Have of... Have you ever watched the, the show man? before? <laughs> Have you ever watched the show before? No. We're talking about pizza, dildos, phones in your ass. We're all over the place. Yep, yeah. Yet yeah, it flows. <laughs> it is one with the universe, my child. So just... But no, but tell me. Let me know. I need to know that. Did you ever read a comic? When I walk in, I need to know. I need you. Did you ever read comic book series? Going on. So you can look at me and say to me, hey, you know what? This is a continuation of the guy with the fingers. You know, the steel fingers. Or fingernails, whatever you want to call it. That kind of thing oh. is hidden in the fucking title of the movie. <laughs> Logan. Then, then I, Wolverine his story. Name is Logan, I mean, so his I name's Logan. Logan. I don't know his name. That's why I called the guy with the fucking fingers. You shouldn't then be maybe anywhere got, near. I don't know his name. Watching this fucking movie, yeah, all right? It's it. not made for you. You got no business. You're not welcome. Don't oh, go. Now you tell me I can't go to the fucking movie. Exactly. Who the fuck are you? Because you got me no go fucking go clue what the movie is even about. Who do you about. think you are? Okay. No, so I can't go to a fucking you, movie. You, you, you. I stick, go to any fucking you movie I want to go to. You stick the la la land. You are. You stick the la la land. I was just saying that. I will. I will fucking give you a time to see la la land. The notebook on ice, that's what that is. Are, are you familiar with comic books at all, really? Not Sir, really. I, okay, Did see, that's the away? thing. See, comic books... See, when I, when I was a kid, I had comic books. We had fucking Underdog. Yeah, we had Archie. <laughs> we used to, you know, I mean, Veronica wasn't bad. You were growing up, you know what I'm saying? Walk. It beat the Stern's fucking catalog. All right, it? the printing press was coming out when you were a kid, I understand. You and understand what I'm saying, yeah, right? And, and print was hot and new then. But see, here's the thing. I'm trying to explain it to you. He's comic still books, trying to get hieroglyphics. Comic, yeah, I know. Comic books... I hate your father. You gotta look at it go in way. different... There's, there's different... There's characters, but there's different plot lines. You lost me and fold the pizza in other way. All right, then. Okay, you lost me that. So why are we talking about things that you have no fucking clue on? Because <laughs> what I'm saying, we'll, tell me. We'll go back to fucking sand, tell me. We'll go back to Sanskrit and hieroglyphs and, and, and printing on with well, chalk and right. paper. What's the, what, shut up. What's the one that's on HBO right now? No one. It just came out like <laughs> I didn't yesterday. See it, but yeah, I know what you're talking about. Legions? You didn't see that? No. I didn't see that one yet. See, but well, you don't even know what it's about. It's a war. I know yeah, that. Yeah, but is that a continuation of all of the ex-people? Or no, the finger guy, the or the broad that changes fucking shape or whatever. Well, well it's a prequel. Are those prequel? Up with it. I'm not up those are prequel, it. right? No. So there's the three original movies. Then there's the new movies with James McAvoy plays yeah. the, the, the bald guy who used to, the guy who was bald and then yeah, yeah. chair. Uh, what's his name? Patrick Charles Stewart. Xavier. Jean-Luc Picard. Yeah, Patrick Charles Stewart. Xavier. Sir Patrick Stewart. Right. Okay. So there's those three original movies. Then there's the new movies. And all of the new movies have been one continuation. Right. It's and now I know series. as much as I did fucking before. They're all. But those were all, all the same thing. It's all one fucking... Yeah, but they're all... This movie, that movie, that movie, that movie, that movie... They went back in time to when they were younger. Well, if you don't know what any of the movies about... How what do they think they, they are? What's his face that? over there? Do you remember one of them? Well, Lucas? No, no, one that goes everything backwards. George Lucas? No, not Lucas. The other guy. Uh, George Lucas? <laughs> it's a vampire one with... Uh, Tom Cruise? No, the, the hot Mexican chick. <laughs> I'm fucking lost. I know who he's Quentin talking Tarantino? about. Uh, Quentin Tarantino. Quentin yeah. Tarantino. Quentin Tarantino. You know how he does everything backwards? Shows you the end of the fucking movie first, and then keeps going? Quentin Tarantino never Holy did a Holy Christ, movie. look at this. Yes, he did. You got Holy fuck. Yeah. He acted in? Yes. I want to see it on there. Let, let, let him show us in Berkeley. Well, Mark Wick got a fucking pizza. <laughs> show me. Show me. <laughs> Holy shit, show us Holy how you eat it backwards. Yeah. It's, it's not, not backwards, it's inverted. It's not even, and this one's not even cut, so good luck. <laughs> we got a pizza. You guys are like retarded. <laughs> Go get a plate. Go get a plate. Show us. Show hey, us. give us a call. Well, what, what He's about to, you're, you're about the to see a man. You're, you're done. You're the Yoda of pizza. I can't wait to, to unsee You're this. about to see a man eat. Pizza Watch everything's going to fall off. So, so let's explain to all the... A we're going to explain to the new people joining right now. Listen, so you got to give me a man first. It's too hot. So you got to wait till it cools, right? Yeah, yeah, Show them the pizza. Oh, now it's too hot. No, you got to wait five minutes. <laughs> you can't have it. You got to wait five fucking minutes. Okay, so now we're going to eat... They're going to eat it well, inverse, 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 inverse too, right? Inverse pizza. And question. right where this is, coincidentally enough, if you go just a little bit lower, call us. At 609-800-1003. That's 609-800-1003. Hey, Gus. Call in now. Hey, Gus. He's, he, they're trying to tell us that Mark, they eat... Uh, no, not they. He, right? like him and his son. 
are trying to get us to eat pizza the other way. It's not normal. normal. So show them wait five minutes. Show look them the traditional way. Show them the traditional way. Traditional way. I'm just. I'm trying to. We got an hour to do on you eating a pizza. Go. Just show them invertly everything. This, this, That's this the way is a normal pizza person will eat a pizza. The way, the way these reports can only figure yeah. out how this is. Any kind of medical condition is going to eat a pizza. Since they the dawn of time. Since, Since the dawn of time. Since the dawn of time. Okay, well, obviously, there's a lot of people who are going to eat a pizza. Then the United States is going to eat a pizza. Watching movies, and he decides, I'm going to eat like this. Look at the fucking way he's eating this. Look at this. You just ate it the same way. We went from 19 people down to 9 now. Do you know why this is happening out there in America? This is what illegal immigrants have done to us. That's right. They come from Poland and they fucking make us buy bottled water. Pretty soon we're going to have to buy canned air and they fucking make us eat pizza invertly. I swear I've never seen that in my life. I've never seen that in my life. What made you think of that on TV? Jesus Christ! <laughs> Does anybody listen when I talk besides Eddie Clark, if you're still out there? Because the truth of the matter is, I said, yeah, we, we, we got this whole concept off of Mark, a television show, off of, off, of, off of the Travel Channel, which you apparently sit home and masturbate to, which hey, you covered. Somebody said, just eat the damn pizza. Yeah, just eat the pizza. I, I'm not the one making a big deal of it. You are the guys that are... I'm going to eat it. Thanks for the pizza, Mark. You're thank hey you, Mark. Bob. Thank that you. Was nice of you. Thank you very much. That was very nice. He just wants to prove him wrong. <laughs> Pull up a chair. Like, matter of fact, lay on the ground. You can talk in that mic. You can lay, <laughs> you can lay there. Yeah, You'll be yeah. comfortable. It would be pretty cool. I'll be seeing like just a head underneath the table. <laughs> Long hair. Bob, I don't. I don't offer to like let you sit on John. I don't offer to let you sit on John's lap. But we already covered that he's like looking forward to going to this thing with three hundred naked men. So it's not naked men. Where do you get naked men? They're fully clothed. They get naked later. They get naked when they get home with their wife. They have to take their shirt off. I don't know. He, he's talking about the cannibal and everything that implies, and I just, I don't know. It scared me. Don't gay it up. Kind of, kind of, kind of. Why are you pulling it back the other way now? It's a good thing. He's gay it up. He's pulling it back the other way. You fold you. See how long it lasted. Look how long it lasted. You folded it back the other way. You fold it back the other way. You piece of shit. Oh, I can't eat it that way. Oh, now you should do it backwards. Oh, yeah, yeah. I never said I don't eat it or I can't eat it that way. You were the guys that can't come up with big fucking a fucking, speech. one fucking topic to come up with. You can't come up with something other a than big, some baby in a box. A big so fucking you got in a box now. We're going to save this in case there's a baby. A baby. There's a baby. There's a child sleeping on the streets of fucking Hamilton, New Jersey. We will donate this box. We can, this sub we can subdivide speech. this box into four probably for like a low income to love section. And, and just so box. you know, if you're in low income and you don't bathe much, it's pre-greased. So we're talking. Okay. Don't, don't you love that he gives a big speech and all of his plays are fucking up for an hour and then he goes back to it. He goes back to, it. Goes back to the regular okay. way. Oh, man. We love I never made a big speech. <laughs> no, no, that's right. You just got here. I have a dream that one day we will all fold our pizza the other way. Either way, I got free pizza. Yeah, Richard Broco is still watching. And he's like, "You're still on the pizza shit." Next Mark week, we got a pizza. Next week, we're going to talk about how we deposit money inversely. Maybe you can bring some money. And I'll show you yeah, we'll do it for you. Just give us the cash. We'll leave it right on your slip. No, I, I have to demonstrate it. Apparently, I'm the demo bitch, so I'll have to demonstrate you it. Right, you give I, us the cash. I, in my head, I could not picture what you were talking about, but I saw how you folded it. That it made the other side like like lip over. It's like, it was like a foldage yeah. in the middle. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And then when you hit that, you folded it back the other way. I got you. Because I felt like so it. So it's good. good. It's good for the first bite. It's actually good for whatever you want. <laughs> you just like things dangling down. Then it was a bolt stuck in his ass. You know, whatever. Okay. Mark, thank you for uh, helping me clarify what the fuck he was talking about. Yeah, that was... It helped. Yeah. This. Thank you. All right, well, Next week, I'm going to come up with an inventive way to eat surf and turf, Mark. So, uh. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God. The fuck Put the taco, works. right? Put the taco. Hey, put the meat on the outside. Right? No, no, no. I said surf and turf. I'm not talking about tacos. Inside that, they have it. Right. Taco Bell shaped shit. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, that's right. They literally stole our idea, so I want credit from Taco Bell. Wait, wait, you guys used to make tacos out of... No, it's, the, it's the inverse pizza idea. They stole that shit. 
I mean, a taco out of it. It's going crazy, isn't it? I'm just glad masks are the same everywhere because. The is gone. You don't watch TV. Taco Bell has had this taco that's made out of a chicken. They shape it like a taco. Yeah, and he was acting it. like it was his idea. Like you guys made tacos well, that way. Well, they, they took that from the apparently pizza. White Castle yeah. has chicken rings. They took so. it from the inverted pizza. They do. That's healthy. Yeah, because chicken comes in ring. Yes. In ring. Boy, form. these guys smoke some good yes. shit. <laughs> that's a, that's, undis that's, undis pizza. that's undisputed. That is undisputed. Okay, it's just. That's fact. That's normal. You guys have a fucked up way of thinking. I don't know about that. I thought it was hard to find a lawyer to take that case. As far as really good shit, yeah. That was good. That was fun. But I'm glad. Glad we got this out of the way. I can sleep at night. How about you guys? Can you guys sleep? I feel at like I should point. be taking a nap right now. I'm like worn out over this. I think anybody that was listening is now taking a nap by now. But it's all good, though. Oh, it's like it's we learned. Fun. We're, we learned. Mark, you want some pizza? Are oh, you going to eat the right way or the wrong way? Yeah. Don't worry. He bought it. What the fuck? Eat, eat it. He can walk in front of the camera all he wants. Yeah. Hey, give us a call at 609 8 0 0 1 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 0 He's saluting you. Hey, oh, there we go. Hey. He's, He's gonna try it. See that? Eating it inside out. That way you don't get a mouth. You don't get a mouth full of crust first. Yeah, you get a mouth full of crust. No, I understand the concept. He did the right thing just, though. You're probably the only one in the room that got the concept. He waited the ten minutes to let it get cold. Okay. What is, what's the difference? You think you fucked up? Oh, you so much better. Um, really? really? That's why you had to refold it the other way. Maybe. No we're gonna start in food, inverting all kinds of foods. We're gonna go. We're gonna do this. We're gonna go bun, lettuce, tomato, then the meat, and then the bun Put with the, the cheese on the, on the outside, <laughs> so we can get the cheese. As long as it's not. No, you bite the, the cheese first. The two meats on the what do you think? Right? I think you. I think it should go like patty. He thought I was serious. Lettuce, lettuce tomato, tomato <laughs> sauce, bun. Yeah, I gotta try that. Lettuce, tomato, sauce, patty. Simply wants to know if this is a pizza commercial. It's not Nino's up in Upper Greenwood Lake. No, it's not, because he still hasn't delivered us anything. No, nah, that son of a bitch. Richard Brokaw, are you listening? Are you related to Tom Bro? I don't know. No, he's not. He's from Hasco. Hey, everybody, everybody on Facebook, this is our producer's ass. Hey. That's our, and that's our operator standing Can by at 609 800 That's our operator standing by. Do you sell those shirts or no? They're just I can get more. No, that's not what I said. Do you sell them or no? No. We should. No, take it. When you eat inverted pizza, you might need a shirt to uh, wipe your greasy hands off. Use two hands, Jesus Christ! Oh, Shake it. Don't point it at me. Don't point that thing at me. They want to, you know. You're not afraid to eat in a room with 300 naked men, but you don't want to put your hand on the other slice of pizza. Bad. Somebody else might want it. I'll be like, like your hand one in the right? sink and one in the pink on the pizza. I like it. I guess so. Yeah. yeah. That's some good ass pizza. Oh, like like Jennifer, Jen's, Jen's gonna kill me. I'm gonna have a heart attack by the end of the show. Jen really? just said, "Did you guys hear about the burger that instead of a bun, it's fried mac and cheese?" I'm yeah. done. I'm done. Oh, what about the donut burger? What yeah, that, you, that's that cheap burger. Cheap uh, burger. No, that's that. Uh, what the hell's it called? Shit. Just Tom Chi. Has Tom Chi has that. Oh my god. You ever go to Tom Chi? No. <laughs> this is thin crust. It's good. They make sandwiches out of donuts, bro. Yeah. It's insane. That's beautiful. It's a beautiful thing. It's a lovely thing. I'm so glad I had surgery. Thanks, guys. <laughs> and I love how this, there's a fan blowing the smell of cheese at my face. Have a piece. Oh. Eh, I'll eat the box later. You know, hurt You can have the baby gum there. Thanks. Fuck the baby. <laughs> baby can live on the lid. There's two sides every box. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> it can live on the inverted side. And where's the baby's table? They put the little white table. Through. Well, we got we got the that's. The baby wipes right there. Oh, okay. The pizza. Right. Two, we, we used to have a changing table. They put that in the middle so the box doesn't hit the cheese. <laughs> you want to change a midget baby? Nothing. Boy, I got nothing to end of this show. Wow. These guys, like, just everybody check out. Have a good one. <clears throat> just kind of, kind of, kind of built and then just kind of. Well, that's why I try to come up with subjects because, you know. Because we're so good at sticking to them? No. <laughs> So what else? We got nothing. Nobody's calling. Nothing. I'm, I'm out of it. I'm out. I got a new. I got a new PlayStation game that uh, to aggravate my fucking girlfriend now that 
I play. Hey, what you got? It? I got. It's got a really long name. It's Tom Clancy's Ghost Recon Wildlands. It looks good. It's dot com. Sick. Dot org. Awesome. Is Lloyd Grin is Lloyd Grin on it? I don't think Craig could handle this game. Craig likes the game where he parachutes in and just can run and kill everybody. <laughs> this one, you have to sneak up and be quiet. I don't think he could handle it. Oh, I think he would have a heart attack if he was trying to play it. Check to, this out! I'm gonna sneak up on this guy and I'm gonna kill him. Watch this. You gotta God talk damn. to each other. You gotta talk to each other. Yeah. Like when you come into an area where you gotta take it over, there's snipers on each roof, and each guy tells each other what. And you mark them, and then I got one, I got two, I got three, I got four. Ready? Fire! Three, two, one. Bing. We take them out, and then we move in. You know yeah, he's, he's, he's not dead coordinated. I don't, think, I don't know if Craig would be able to handle that. Craig likes to come it's in, a little, ride a, a little horse, too low key for him. And just, you know. Well, he's fun to watch. He should have his own show, though. While he's playing the game, he yell, "Oh my God, it's hysterical!" He just gets yeah. and he has Wait. the worst luck in video games, too. Well, we got to go over to his house and just videotape him playing it. We'll oh, just put it up as a podcast, uh, dude. I'm telling you, that would be an hour of just him playing. It's hysterical. <laughs> he goes around there's a, in uh, <laughs> Battlefield <laughs> One. You could be a medic, so he's a medic and he's running around, and uh, he's saving everybody's life, right? So a grenade blows up and kills me. So he's right there. He's like, "I got you, booed. I'm like, "All right, thanks." Well, the grenade that killed me hit a tree. And, and the tree now, fell over. The tree is falling, and it crushes him after he kills me. And he just loses his. Yeah, <laughs> You see that? I help you, and I get crushed and killed. What the fuck? Thanks a lot for that shit. And is anybody going to save me? No, no, no. I'll just sit here and die and die. I got to need him. Nobody's going to. Look at it. Oh, this guy's walking right over me. I see there's a medic two feet away. Jen said she's got to put earplugs on because he's playing something right now. Oh, Christ. Elizabeth Ann Edwards says, Happy steak and blowjob, guys. Nice. Day. Said what? When is that? Happy Steak and Blowjob Day. Today. When is that? Today? Is that? March, well, she said March 14th, but she says out there now. So oh. She's listening. I never, there's and a, she's going to be where? There's what a holiday. <laughs> there's a holiday for every day of the week, I swear. Isn't there? She it didn't, she didn't call what an address or, you know, I'll be appearing at or uh, was, any of that shit. Is today Women's Day or was that yesterday? Yes, yes, yes. International, international Women's Day. How is it a United States holiday? And <laughs> that, it's sounds, international. that sounds about right. It's no, International no, Women's no, Day, no, and the men are just hearing about it today. That sounds about right. It's not worldwide, but it's a UN thing. It was introduced to the we got a caller, guys. Hopefully, we got a caller. Somebody called? Hey, welcome to uh, uh -oh. Buddha Radio. You got a <laughs> stupid holiday you want to talk about? Go ahead. Uh, Battlefield Day. Oh, there you go. Oh, Christ. Hey, buddy. I've been waiting to go to the bathroom. <laughs> we were, we were, uh... Well, you know, it's funny. I, I wasn't going to call in, but then, you know, after you said you had nothing left and you started talking about me, I figured I had to fill in the last half hour. <laughs> yeah, we were, we were, Phil, were you, did you listen at all or no? <laughs> yeah, I've been listening all night. Well, I, I had to take, my neighbor came by and asked me if I could take, take us somewhere, so I did, and I, it was cutting in out as I was driving, but I, I listened for most of it. Yeah. Well, you know there's a phone number you could call and listen to the show now. He's got set up. It's pretty cool. So if you... If you yeah, but I, I'm not that committed. You should be committed. My wife won't. You should be in a white, blue, small room right now. And just to let you know, I would be an amazing... Uh, why am I missing online access? I'm trying to go on the game now, and it's not loading. He's very easily distracted. He's very distracted. I don't even know how he has children, because I would think he, in the middle of sex, he would go and get water. He's like, that dog got up. And just forget what he's Squirrel. doing. No, Squirrel. I'm saying, I, I, I was calling to you guys, and I would be very, I would be very good at, at uh, Ghost Recon. I want to see what's going to happen, because you're used to running in and just killing everybody, bro. So I want to No, that's say, not true. I, 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 I can stealth like a mother. All right, I can't wait. We're going to have a GoFundMe page so you can buy the game, because <laughs> those games are expensive as shit. I had a move. I know. I want. I had to think. I'm I like. Want to buy. I'm like. Should we go to Shoprite this week? <laughs> I'm like. We're gonna buy Ghost Recon. Ah, eh, we'll eat some canned foods. We got canned foods for this week. <laughs> well, I, I'm having an issue where my, my it's not my thing. My game isn't going online right now. I hate this shit. What the internet? Oh, oh look. Yeah. What the fuck? Online status is telling me I'm off. <laughs> why? Why is it off? Well, thankfully your phone isn't cutting out. We can hear you perfectly. So that, that's good for us. Anyway. Yeah, all our listeners are like, very excited hey, was, uh, that you can't get a fucking Spike, wake up. What was Spike eating just now? Oh, my God. Seriously? Oh, that was a Domino pizza? Yeah, he's eating Invertedly. It. Invert <laughs> invertedly <laughs> Stick around. He's going to stick a slice up his ass and see if it fits. He says if you fold the pizza the other way. It's going to be like the phone. It's easier. <laughs> and you know what's funny where he is right now? 
He's washing his hands because he probably he's got ready fucking... to just take that slice and stick it right up his fucking ass. Hands. Invertedly, no less. Make he's going to turn it invertedly, stick it up his ass, pull it out, take a bite. And we're going to see what happens. Poor Mark had to run and get pizza to, so Spike could show us this bullshit. So. You ever eat it that way before? You ever heard of such a thing? We speak in uh, English. No. Did you just get over the fucking wall? Hello? He's there. Hello? I mean, I just said no. I never ate it like that. Food radio, where everyone tells each other to go fuck themselves. <laughs> I, I know, it's great. Let, let me call in and not talk. I love you, bro. What are you playing right now? You trying to get on? I am I am talking. He was talking to me. Are you kidding me? I'm trying to be quiet. I'm trying to be the, the nice guy. Nice again. And, uh, don't be nice, be you. We like you. Listen, yeah, 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 don't, don't bullshit you're anymore. More Your wife knows you're not even nice. You're more interesting. <laughs> hey, I'm just tired. I worked hard today. I, I'm, I'm up in uh, Oneonta this week, and I'm driving to Oneonta tomorrow. Yeah, what did you work construction today? Right. Yeah. What did you dig in the hole? Or you had yeah, a hole? No, no, I ripped apart a deck instead. They're going to have you work tomorrow yeah, in the snow? What is your job in here? You gonna work tomorrow in the snow? No, I, I have a comedy show. I'm up in Oneonta. Where the hell is that? Where the hell is that? New York. Uh, way up, up almost by Cooperstown. Oh, okay. State. Yeah, well, are you leaving tonight? I think it'll be all right by yeah, tomorrow. No, I'm leaving about leaving about noon Not tomorrow. That way. We were gonna leave. No, we were gonna leave at one. I'm with Tommy Gucci. We we're gonna leave at like one, but we we're going to leave at twelve. It's about a three and a half, four hour trip normally. Yeah, well, so you, you know it's gonna be about five or six, right? There's a lot of traffic what? and the snow. You're gonna be, you're gonna be. Yeah. Well, the snow is more what we worry about. Shit, the next weekend, uh, me and Buddha are up in we're upstate. Well, hopefully it's melted by then. So, so is uh, John. Oh, John's up there too. Oh man, their show. We'll be alright. We're gonna have a blast though. Oh, we have a great show. Yeah, we got we got rooms. We got, you know, it's a winter wonderland up there. It's part of the uh, St. Patrick's Day celebrations. Yeah, it's, oh, it's a whole it's a whole weekend of uh, music, and 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 we're in a special event this comedy, but it's like ten, twelve bands. Yeah. Uh, it's it's uh, uh, you know, a whole thing of they for a weekend. It's a whole weekend package when they go up and they get music and food and drink all included. It's at the, uh, the Euphoria Village up in Lexington, up by on Hunter Mountain. And, yeah, uh, pretty, I, pretty we cool. try to look up to go to John's show, but it's two hours away, so we're just gonna stay where we are because we'll never make it. Yeah, we looked. We we did briefly look into seeing if we could have got back to you, but it, it was a yeah, two-hour drive. So. No, that's cool. That would have been back. cool. That yeah, would have been nice to have you guys there. It would have been really nice. But hey, cool. you know, you can't. Yeah, you well, can't we look. We did look into it. Buddha, you know, me and Buddha looked into it. Buddha wanted to try, and I thought it would have been a cool thing if we could have went from one to the other. But it was a two-hour trip, and, and our show is not going to be over until maybe 10 or 11. And, and you know, we got the hotel, and we got free liquor and free food. I want to I want to utilize the weekend and have a good time with the wife. I, I can't wait to wake up Sunday morning naked laying next to Craig and be like, what happened? <laughs> 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 uh, the girls will be in one room, we'll be in the other. Oh, yeah. <laughs> They're in the quiet room. I'll be your father. If you only knew I <laughs> hear in the background. Yeah, she just goes, yeah, that's about right. And I won't have to use, <laughs> Craig, I won't have to use force. He comes willingly. Hey, Jen me and Marissa are going to get a good night's sleep. Oh, yeah. Me and Buddha are going to bring up our PlayStations and sit next to each other. Playing. <laughs> no, no, I plan on drinking. Buddha doesn't drink much, so it's gonna have, we're going to have a blast on that. Yeah, yeah no, I'm, I'm not a big drinker either, so I'm, I'm looking forward to it. So I like the fact that we have the room. And You're not allowed to chew on ice the whole time we're there, by the way. I'm, I'm not allowed to what? You're not allowed to chew on ice the whole time we're there. The first, yeah, I don't have enough teeth left the first, in my mouth to chew on ice. The first night I met Craig, the first, one of the I first broke nights, like three of them he pieces. broke his teeth. I'm like, bro, what, do you, what did you chew? He's like, I broke it on ice. I'm like, oh, Jesus, comedian's fucking healthcare. I get it. <laughs> <laughs> what do you put hey, what, on what the, Go ahead. What's right? No, what do you, what do you no, put I'll, to help with the swelling on broken teeth? After broken ice, you just leave it in. <laughs> fucking <it's> right there. <laughs> My mom called in before. She's like, oh, I heard. Christ, I, heard. I, actually, uh, I sent a little message because right after that was another call, and it was nobody there. And, and I said it was your father. It was <laughs> and he tried to get it first. She called it first, so he called. He hung up on you. 
No, I think it was her calling back again because she wanted to hear the rest of the show. I think she called. Butt-dialed this. That's funny. Maybe she had yeah, one of those. Uh, hopefully she didn't have one of those phones that she had. One of those new ass. phones. <laughs> So, Spike, you got it, brother. This is the hey. quietest Spike has been all night. Inadvertently, all this is sticking up your ass. Why don't we do this? <laughs> I'm, I'm going to roll well, all four of those slices well, and, and, and just like cram them in your rear end. I don't know what's going on right now. Spike and, and had until, pizza. Until it's as red as your eyes. Candy, he's make a like coffee, a yodel. He's and make he's had a whole half. half what is this? A half cup? Pizza. Yeah. Yodel. I don't quart. know what that is. A quart? He had a quart of lemon-flavored piss is what he had. Basically. But all right, don't worry, you, you can eat your pizza any way you want when you're on my show. Well, thank you very much. <laughs> yeah, I no appreciate problem. that. Thankfully, it's only... Now, hopefully, we yeah, actually have know. another show on air sometime. <laughs> in the near future. That's, that's why you know, he said that. Years, I, you know, comedy. <laughs> you guys, I thought you guys were going to cover me, and, and, and you had to do your own thing. And I, 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 I was willing to cover. I just don't think that um, me by myself last week. Is, is, is the kind of representation you want... For your radio show, me by myself, not a good combination. That's who. Uh -huh. That's who would have hosted last week's show. It would have been Stoner Radio. Are you kidding me? Like, Are you kidding me? Take whatever meds you took before this show and and get some pizza and eat it invertedly and, and sit back and enjoy the ride. People would think. Yeah, you could play with that phone. And people everything. would think it was foggy yeah. out, but it's just the smoke in the room. Just leave the smoke in the just room. Just leave the smoke in the room. <laughs> It's Folks, we are, we are not on fire. The station is not on fire. <laughs> Please do not call. We control the vertical. We control the horizontal. So you got to work tomorrow. The snow, the outer limits. The snow is going to come. It's, we only get two or three inches, though, guys. Relax. It's not like we're getting, you know, a foot. Yeah, rain. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, it's, it's supposed to be a rain snow mix. I'm you going upstate, so it might be a little more snow. And then uh, my truck is going. I'm not taking my truck. I'm going up with Tommy Gooch in his car. And I'm putting my truck in the shop Monday. I'm finally getting it fixed. The head is... Well, hopefully it's front-wheel drive. <laughs> yeah, his little car is probably front-wheel drive. Two bold guys and two bold tires in the snow going to New York State. <laughs> Sounds like a movie. <laughs> <laughs> they were two bold guys. Craig, i got to bring you one of these Oreo eggs to you, man. You like, you like the Cadbury's or no? You're not into that. Yeah, he really uh, does not no, like No, I don't mind the Cadbury's. They, they sounded interesting. Yeah. I, I definitely want to try one. Yeah, it's bigger than a oh, Cadbury. Yeah, they were, it, it just, it just, they, they didn't like it. Yeah. Well, it, like, I, you know what? If they were, I guess it's oh, a John, I know John, John didn't like it at all. You know what I'm saying? No. Cause Cause you you gotta, it, it, no, it was so soft. Yeah, that the, the, the chocolate you had was kind of gooey. The whole thing in your mouth. It was kind of gooey. Yeah, it was gooey. Well, well Spike yeah. and John and didn't chew it. You could let it melt five minutes. I threw it in here. I only took a small bite. So you can avert it. It was so hot in the studio. It fucking the lights melted. I apologize. When you got you got two spotlights on us, right? You got two fat guys, <laughs> and you got a stoner next to you. I'm going to say the humidity is higher than normal in this room. I'm just going to say. The air is Well, you got to think of both of, the, both of those guys, too. When they get something chocolate, uh, hot and gooey in their mouth, it's usually man-made. So <laughs> I didn't like the stuff that was packaged. Uh, I'm sorry. I'm not like you, pal, right? You know, I'm not from fucking Staten Island, all right? I'd have no clue what that meant, but I get it. Though. Yeah, that's the way the Staten Island guys are. See, that's Staten that's Island guys just put anything in their mouth. They that's don't it. care. They, they just, just they, throw they, it they in just their do mouth. it. They just throw it in their mouth. They question it. it later. I'm from Staten Island. I'm from, from Staten, Staten Island. Island. You think you can scare me? I can eat this I shit. I don't care. I got more in my fucking body you can ever think about. I breathe uh, in there. There they go. I fired them back up again. Yeah. Thank you. There you go. You can do another two hours now, Spike. No. That's all we needed was the bellows. <laughs> <laughs> well, listen, boys. Good show tonight. It was funny. Liar. From what I can hear, when you weren't all talking and yelling and screaming over each other, and uh, <laughs> you mean when you weren't yelling and screaming at the PlayStation? If I don't see you through the week, I'll see you through the window. Okay. Hey, hey, there you go, man. Love that boxers. Oh, and that was, and that was the other, that was the other thing I, I said before you, but that you guys had covered it. That your poor wife was very happy right now with the baby because. You know, you know, here in Jersey. Well, you know what? I don't know which. You know what's messed up? I don't. I don't know which link you. Um, I don't know. See, Facebook Live is messed up. I don't know which one I'm watching. But if you commented on, I don't know which page you went to and comment. We can't see all the. I, I watch on. I watch on Conti's all the time. It's just. Yeah. It's always the first one that pops up on my page. So every week, that's the one that usually gets my my vote, my credit, because it's the first one that pops up. Uh, it's either that or maybe it was on CraigWagner.com. You might have found it on www.craigwagon.com Did you say it now? <laughs> really? <laughs> plug, plug, really? Plug, plug? Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, no, no plug. plug, plug, plug. I wouldn't do that. Like, just 
Hey, you were, you were, you were catching up to me. Uh, on Radio. You were catching up to me on uh, news on your website. So then I had. I have fans, I guess. I don't know. Well, to pull away, I just sat. My mom. My mom really likes to. <laughs> well, I, I went to my website and put a Band-Aid on the F5 and walked away so I could pull away from you. Yeah, I, I haven't been on it in a couple of days. I gotta go on it. Refreshing, refreshing. I gotta, I gotta add some stuff. I have some pictures. I gotta add this and things. I gotta add. Well, really, Jen. I say it like I do it. Well, if she has problems, give me a call. I'll take care of it. Yeah, no, she, she's pretty savvy with it now, but she, she does when she needs it. She always does. You know that. And thank you, of course. CraigLogan.com wouldn't be positive, uh, possible without through to the comedian.com's assistance and building <laughs> techniques. I changed my, so, I revamped my whole page. You should check it out. That sounded like a wet, sloppy blowjob, didn't it? It did. Yeah. But we're going to go on the show. We're going to end the show in a few minutes. But uh, as always. Uh, yeah, so go, guys, go. Listen, I, I love you all. Go, baby. Uh, yeah. I, I enjoyed the night tonight. Enjoy your cannibal corp. Uh, Mr. Condi, I, I performed and that was a nightmare for me because <laughs> I remember. I went to go perform and they brought food out and dessert. The guys will turn it back on. Because they were looking at Craig and Car sharpening up those hey, knives. Like, come here, little boy. That food comes out. They don't care. They can have a naked burger. No, place. man. Uh, the food was over, but then like a thing of dessert. like eighty-seven different desserts came out. Holy that Jesus. was it. And cakes and all the other stuff and. And they literally turned their backs to eat of the call. I and felt bad for you. Can't compete with food. It felt it was like trying to do food. it was like trying to do comedy in a strip club, and the girls came out. And right. They all, now right, they want to see the they want to see the boobies. They don't want to hear the comic. I know. All it's right. The same thing, but it was it was an interesting. Uh, That's why I don't perform. It is a wild event. To say at least. That's why I don't perform at Carvel's anymore. Because you know, <laughs> yeah, there you go. It, it is a wild event, right? though, isn't it, Craig? <laughs> Oh, absolutely. I mean, it was absolutely amazing. It was, I mean, the food, I'm not a, I'm not a foodie in that sense. I didn't eat half of that stuff, but I was amazed at what they had to offer. I tried things that were, I never had before. I liked a couple of things, and it was things, things I didn't like. I actually tried almost everything, even if I didn't want to eat it. Did, did you have, I did you have it. the boiled lamb's head that was smiling back at you? Did you have I that? Did, I did, yeah, we I did. tried it, and I, I did not it. like it, but yeah. I did try it. Would you so try it? it on the table, and I, I think I mean, Taking it from John, like someone, someone had it. I, I gave it a little more. It was more me. It was me. I had it. it. I had it. You know what? It I wanted to. I wanted to try it. I don't think next time, if I'm going to try brain, that I suggest eating it out of someone's head. Like put it in something else. Maybe? You can't eat with something smiling at me like that. Yeah, you can't do it. I think it makes it more friendly. No. <laughs> yeah, it, it was very. It was very odd that it was. Yeah, it was, like you could totally see the face and everything. And the else. fucking tongue. But it's like how it's hanging out. It was not like you're going to sit there French kissing. It was, it was everything that they prepared was really good too. Like even if I didn't like it, it wasn't. I didn't like it because. I didn't do a good job making it. I didn't like it. I did. It wasn't what I, I was looking for. Right, it wasn't your thing. But, uh, I did pass on, it wasn't my on thing. the... Uh, but I the did. stuff that I did like uh, <laughs> was absolutely <laughs> delicious. It was just amazing. It was like 300 guys. <laughs> and uh, like I said, just... You just can't do a show like that when they bring out dessert. Oh. You gotta perform after they're done eating. I did pass on the um, sweetbreads. I didn't eat those. Oh, sweetbreads are good. No, I delicious. I couldn't. Yeah, I I couldn't. So, but on I that note, uh, have a great night, guys. I love you all, and uh, I'll see you all soon. Take care. Love you, brother. Thanks. Thank you. Craig have a great night, guys. Show. Later, later, later James. Show. You'll see me soon. <laughs> <laughs> I will hope so. You won't see him coming. Right, later, guys. You won't see him coming now. Craig Lloyd, Craig Lloyd, everybody. Craig. CraigLoyden.com, Testosterone Show, every Tuesday and Tuesday when he shows when up. He feels when he shows up. <laughs> it, it, it's supposed to be the second and fourth Tuesday of the month. Which is fucked um, up to even try to say in human words. Yeah. Invertly. And if um, you know his brain at all, there's no way that that even connects into any kind of real time frame. <laughs> no, because how do you set an alarm every other Tuesday? It's fucking weird. I just text him somewhere along Monday night and say, are we doing a fucking show? And he answers you on Wednesday. No. <laughs> yeah, basically. You know, it's funny. You or, I'm not going to be there. You can do the show. He used to ask me, he says, why can't I have every week? Well, there, there's one reason right there. If we have another show, but would you be able to do it every week? You probably would. If it was every week, you would. Well, if it was every week. every you... other week. It's well, rough. It's rough, dude. I, I couldn't I pay that bridge toll every week. I know. No, got, but like Bobby you, and I we got to do it remotely show. somehow. What is it, $14 to go over one week? We can do it. Yeah. We can do anything you want. Yeah, it's not real. It's rough. It's $14, a, a sperm count, and 
You can't eat pizza overtly yeah, in the yeah. car on the way over. In order to slap it out of your hand. I don't think New you Jersey's the only state you gotta pay. I don't think you can take pizza. You can come in for free. We don't give a shit. Come on in. We don't care who the fuck you are. Come on yeah, in. I don't, I, don't, I don't think they'll let you, you bring out? You uh, non Staten pay. Island pizza onto Staten Island from Jersey. From New York, maybe, but definitely not from Jersey. You, you can't take pizza onto Staten Island from Jersey. I'm pretty sure it's a law. It's a law? <laughs> <laughs> it is not a law. Listen, Staten Island is Jersey. It's just. Separated by some garbage. That's it. In no, a weird accent. No, it doesn't think it's it doesn't think it's Jersey. It thinks it's New think. York, but it's not it's I not part think. of New York proper, but it's New York. It, it never said think. I said it is. No, it's not. Part it's, of Jersey. It's it is separated by garbage and a metal bridge. It's kind of like the taint of New York. Had it been closer, <laughs> it would just be Jersey if there was no water. When it dries well, that's up, a fucked up way of thinking, man. Yeah, well, oh, everybody in Staten Island's gonna fucking castrate you. Yeah. 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 Um. The thoughts you that and that expressions. No, <laughs> fuck! I don't care. Uh, I booted, a booterated. Do not support all the <laughs> expressions <laughs> as Spike does because no, I way. have to drive yeah, through that island. Island. <laughs> And uh, yeah, I want to be able to to visit you guys. If I go to any of the shows, it's because I'm snuck in as like his his uh, entourage or whatever. Anyhow, so it's not like anybody's ever gonna know I'm there. So I don't care. Not so much. And that's right, I said it. Staten Island's kind of like the taint of New Make York. Make sure you I said charge it. him to get in next time. <laughs> I ain't set a paint no more. <laughs> well, he's all stoned, we'll be like, no, you didn't pay. Here. <laughs> He'll keep paying this whole fucking night. It's like, no, no, you didn't pay yet. He was like, I paid? No, he's no, a stoner, not pay. a stupid. Uh, uh, I'm having a good time. You having fun? Have I'm time. always having a good it's time. It's like the Fat Albert song. <laughs> hey, hey, hey! <coughs> it's bad <laughs> comedians! We're going to have a good time, too. John and Buddha and Stoner for you. Sorry, I'm back now. Good night. <laughs> it's just, you know, when you when you try to help someone with mental illness, it, you know, it just, sometimes it bites you in the ass. Yeah, sometimes. Yeah, every week I tell them the same thing. Putting your helmet on, a little red little bus. Go, go, go. It's a blue it's bus, you uh, son of a bitch. I wish you'd pay attention to You look at the it's window on the bus. way. You look at the window. Don't make sure put, it's a clean. Put your helmet on. <laughs> Put your helmet on. It's a blue bus. bus. Little bus will come and get you right now. It's a blue bus. Look at the window. Have a good time. We will be back next week, uh, as always, 6.30. We got some plugs. We have plugs. Um, Plugs. Hair plugs, ear plugs. Go ahead. Those plugs. Go ahead. We got got LaughterLoungeComedyClub.com. Whatever. (laughs) LaughterLoungeComedyClub.com for all your events. Guys, if you guys are having parties... You guys want to do fundraisers? Specialize in children's parties. We work. We work out. Do what we got to do. Okay, we bring the best comics. A lot of good, good comics. Comics. Boxes. A lot of good comics. All right. Right now, what's on uh, the list is uh, on March 18th, um, Saturday night, up at Greenwood Lake, New York, at the Cove Castle, which used to be the Castle Tavern. Two shows. We added a second show, uh, and it's a free event. Come on out and have a good time. Eddie Clark, myself, and Mike E. Keegan. Keegan, Mike Keegan, Keegan, not Egan. No, Keegan, K E E K E Keegan. And then um, after that, I really do know more of this shit. On March twenty fifth, <laughs> March twenty fifth at the Cove the in Bayville, time. New Jersey. Apparently. The Cove in Bayville. We have Chips Cooney from America's Got Talent with Johnny Rizzo, and I couldn't tell you who's hosting that one. Uh, Tim uh, Shea? Hayes. No, Tim it's Hayes. Tim Hayes. Tim Hayes, yeah. wow. Tim Hayes is hosting that show. Hilarious. And then after that, what do we he lives by me, you know. I should go to him. He should be my he's chiropractor. He's a good guy. He's a chiropractor. Really? Yeah. He's a good yeah. guy. He's funny, too. And then uh, we have um, on April 8th, the special event. Is that the Goombas? That's the Goombas. That's the big pussy one, man. Yeah, that's... Uh, it's going to sell out. What? Oh, definitely going to sell out. It's at the Cove on April 8th in Bayville, New Jersey. His only... New Southern New Jersey appearance. He's not going to Lenox wow. City. He's not going anywhere. We have him yep. at the Laughter Lounge Comedy Hook Club at the Cove in Bayville. Go to our website. Click on the poster, guys. You can yeah, buy tickets it. ahead of time. It's, it's Sal, Big, Big Pussy, Pussy. Bumpin' Cero, nice. who's really Vincent Pastor from The Sopranos with Goomba Johnny and Buddha and myself. What a great show that's going to be. I'll be hiding in the crowd. It's going to be a great show. you got to come out and check that out. Uh, they got a dinner show package that's unbelievable. If you come out, I think it's uh, 
to see Vinny Pastor and the rest of everybody, uh, I think it's like fifty-five dollars uh, with a you know dinner and a show. And if you have dinner, you get preferred seating. It's great. You gotta come check that out. And then uh, what, what do we got after that one? I don't know. We'll talk about it next. Oh, week. April. No, and then April twenty. What is it? The the twenty second. I don't know, bro. I think Chris, it's we April twenty second. Before ahead. <laughs> um, the Heights Town show. Which one? The Heights Town the Elks. Uh, Elks. Yes. Oh yeah, we're in Elks Club. It's me and you. And Missy. Missy and uh, Shay. Yes. Yeah, it's a great show. So in if you're in the Heights Town area, we're going to be in Heights Town soon. Just go to laughterloungecomedyclub.com or bootofthecomedian.com. You can buy all your tickets. All the links are up. If you can't figure out how to buy us, we don't want you at your show anyway because you're probably fucking brain dead. <laughs> <laughs> or you can go to the Laughter Lounge page here on uh, Facebook and also my page and Buddha's page. We advertise all the shows. Good night, everybody. Thank you very much. Love you much. guys. Have a good night. Peace. Buddha Take out. Take care. Wait, who's that? We're right out of here. Who's that? We're going to make that for the last time. Get out of it.